Is I know you're hiding somewhere. It's better you come out, oh. Come out, oh. Come out to this girlfriend, oh. Come here. How many times have I told her not to be touching my phone? How many times did I tell you not to be coming here? No, 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 no. Is your mother like me? Uh, no. No, no. Do I look like that? Your cost mother? Uh, sorry, mama. Sorry, mama. Ma mama. I hope you have finished the work I gave you at the farm. Yes, I finished everything. Where is your benefit? I I don't know. Hey! What Even the Bible says be your brother's keeper. You don't know anything. You're just a dummy. Ah! Uh, 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 Mama, as you are looking for Ujuma, she's not around. What do you want her to do? I will do anything you want to do to do for you. You will do anything? Yes, Mama. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He go go phone. Now well, now yeah well. He go go phone. Mm. I told her not to touch my phone. Eh? Obi Kanya, she went and broke my phone. Hey, Mama. Hey, about. The phone. Uh, it's it's not to do one that broke the phone. No. It's me. Please. It was a mistake. I'm sorry. You broke my phone. Mistake. Mistake. Eh? Mistake. The phone I wanted to carry it from. No, no, no. I saw one of them. No, it's where you get now. Yeah. My phone? You called my phone ordinary. My phone I kept and she went and collected it and broke the screen. Huh? Oh, don't see me pressing her neck now. It's not nice. It's not fair. You want to kill her? I want to go go phone. I want to go I did believe you were going to go to the house. I want You come here. Nonsense. You come here. Sister, why did you do it? Why do you always accept something that you're not guilty of? Do you know I can never stand to see Mama punish you? I love you very much. But I can't keep taking falls for your action. You have to do better. I told you not to touch her phone, but you will not listen. Eh? Now see the thing I'm going through because of you. It's not fair. Just I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Eh? Miko. It's okay. It's okay. Just just try to do better, would you Miko? Oh, so that I, I will not just be suffering unnecessarily. Oh, yeah, no problem, I agree you. But, but why does she not like you referring to her as mother? I mean, your, your mother is dead and she's the only mother you have now in your life. I, I just know that one day Mama is going to change. Yes, start seeing me as her daughter. But in the meantime, just, just to be... Hi, I see you. Bring it down, bring it down. Mama is not coming now. Bring it down. Bring it down. Don't rest. Ha! I support you. They pay them like 2,000 or 3,000 every day on a daily basis. Do you understand? And my phone screen you broke is 29,000. Mama? Mama Guinea. 
that phone. The new one is not up to 29,000. Buy me a new phone, no, no. Hey, buy me a new phone. I don't care how much it is. How any amount I put is my, my own. You will be walking here. Eh? You know how long it will take you to be able to raise that 29,000. Okay, ma. Okay, mama. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Sorry. I think I'll start slapping you each time you call me mama. How can I do? Sorry, mama. Sorry, sorry. Do sorry. Sorry. Do I look like your stupid mother? Nonsense. Um, ma it's just my school. You know my school. I have to go to school in the morning. I can be coming here in the afternoon to work after school, so I will not miss my classes. Then only I may have day. If you start doing half day, you know how long it will take you to get that money for my screen. Eh? You will be coming here from six to six, full day job. Yes, call Ben Kenke. So that they will pay you and my money, my phone, you fix it for me. Whether you like it or not, six to six. Bian now, come, oh, come. Um, who be now, Who be Hey, ma. Go check whether I see that around. Mama, what do you go do for you? Uh, I won't see her. You won't see her? What are you doing? I'm hungry. But I left food for you now. No, Mama, I don't want to eat that one. I don't want to eat that one. I want to drink mineral. Must you drink mineral all the time? Eh? Okay. Okay, you know where my purse is. Go there, collect money and go and buy mineral. <laughs> Mama, thank you. <laughs> Get me water to drink, if you Hey, what do you do? This is pure wickedness. Mama, what is that to gain? This is pure wickedness. Sister, what is that to I love you as my mother. I care for you as my sister. I support you in all that you do. One name, I always stand for you, no matter what you do. So they open mouth like that, may you know swallow me. Okay. Alpha. Uh, uh, tomorrow morning, you guys should uh, carry the mini box in. There's not a uh, walking tomorrow. Nice uh, strong yellow. Okay. How many work you do today? Enjoy the cat. Wow. You put something for us. You give home at three thousand. You give us three thousand. Wow. You know the shame. Wow. You know the shame. Woman walk past you. Eh? Wow. You like Bruce Lee. This is where you're going to sleep. You are sleeping outside today. 
of one kid, Jay Eh? Shut up! It won't again, I'll slap you. And all your teeth will fall on the floor. Who do you think I am? Eh? Sorry, I promise you I was robbed and I was coming back. Shut up! Oh. Uh, you think I'm stupid? Uh, they, they stole the money from me. Who so stole it? The money from me. You think I'm stupid? I'll send you to go and go, go and make money. You come back without the money. You tell me they robbed you. Lying, you want to do what I give you? I swear, I swear on my mother's grave. I does, am not lying. Does your mother have a grave? Uh, eh? That your stupid mother, Emwe raw foresight. If she had foresight, she wouldn't have named you blessing. She would have named you a curse because that is what you are. You will sleep here. This is where you will sleep. Okay, Eat your okay, food. Mama, I'm, go I'm going to sleep here, but I'm hungry. I'm not eating anything today. I'm, yeah. I'm going to faint. Bianola, you're hungry. I would be the one to cook the one you eat. You go out there. Uh, no, nah, nonsense. I'm staying here, cook. And you want to eat it. This is your bed tonight. Sleep here. Hey! Please! Oh my I will. What is good about this morning? Eh? You want to sleep till 11 a.m. Chiofobe. Mokem. Wash this um, bucket. Wash it thoroughly in and out. Hmm? Yalaru. Yalaru. Uh-huh. Don't enter my house like this. So. Pass through the backyard. This is pure wickedness. Mama won't you stand to gain. This is pure wickedness. Sister, what you stand to gain? I love you as my mother. I care for you as my sister. I support you. Wa, eat. You need the food more than myself. Oh? Yeah. Uh, libe, 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 libe. <laughs> I am ready to go to work. I was talking. You eat my canon. Couldn't you have allowed me finish? Sometimes you behave like somebody who lacks home training. Sorry, ma'am. Eh? Sorry. What did you say? That I'm ready to go to work. Eh, go on now. You want to take me along? No. If you like, eh? You know the money they will pay you? Throw it away. Come home and give me one cock and bull story. Of course, you know the consequence. You know, okay? I'll sleep outside. Eh, eh, ma'am. Good. But mama, this is not fair. Let her at least eat and... Uh, Will you shut up? You eat and do what? Eh? No, finish your sentence now. Let her eat and choke or eat and die, idiot. Are you still here? You know, I'm going to let her belly. Get out, too, sir. Nonsense. Mama, this is not good. This is wickedness. It's not good. Chuko, chuko, pokwa, goko. I don't blame you. It's because I gave you food to eat. If I had eaten this food without giving you, would you have had, had strength to come and talk to me anyhow? One day, eh? One day you will anger me. I will slap you and forget my hand on your cheek. Stupid idiot. Oh my God, what Are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, it's not fair. Stupid girl. Uh, no Defender of the universe. <laughs> Come and eat, Osa. Come and eat. Hey, Ebuka, what happened? I know that Arisa was embarrassing you at the stream. What, what did you do to him? 
he do 5k because of 5k that's that i'm owing that idiot that that boy that boy harassed me in fact to a point of even threatening my life me ibuka ibuka has it got to the level that you could not afford ordinary five thousand naira? are you that broke is that one a joke or what? Are you not aware of my, my financial situation? Which one is that one? I'll buy a girl. You don't have financial situation. Don't you have a girlfriend? And so what? Does she work? Does she have any job? The one that works or the one that is jobless? Which one is that? Olga, have you asked your girlfriend money? Have you? Even if she don't have money, her mother might have. Or her brother. Or even her boyfriends. Hi. Do you have seen me finish? This is pure C finish. Boy, who is the boyfriend now? Me now. I will ask myself for money now. Okay, you think you are the only boyfriend that she has? See, let me tell you, if you have a girlfriend, ask your girlfriend money. All these are our girlfriends, they have money. I don't think you are the only guy that she's dating you. She have one other guy that might be spoiling her with money. You'll be here for me, you are the girlfriend, you are the boyfriend, you are the boyfriend, you are the lover. One guy will just come from nowhere, marry her, and you will not gain anything. I swear to God, you do since I met you, since I've known you, this is the first reasonable point you've made. See all this. You'll be there for me, boyfriend. Oga, okay? ask your girlfriend money. All these girls, you are they have money. Oh. I've been sleeping. Oh. They have guys that are giving them money. Well, why didn't Always you? ask your girlfriend money. They have money. Your girlfriends are your investment. Uh, not to like investment, you too. Uh, okay, go, I will have like five girlfriends. Yeah, I'm telling you, I'm thinking of increasing my girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, you are there. Someone is embarrassing, embarrassing, you embarrassing you because of I've my agreed, but maybe we have girlfriends in investment. Hey, you are not going to be here. Hey, you are going to Hey, how are you? I'm fine. I was coming to your house. Actually, yeah. uh, so you took this shortcut, eh? Uh, uh. <laughs> but let's go back because um, I wanted to go to the market. Ah, no need for me to go back. Okay. Uh, I, I brought this for my niece uh, because I, I wanted to go and see my doctor to collect some drugs. Now that I've seen you, no need to go back with you. Eh? Okay. We'll just go home. Okay. Uh. Which of your nieces? Uh, I'm going to see now. Oh, Mini Nuju is not your niece. Ah, come on, look at my I didn't say so now. Uju is my niece, but you know Uju is covered. Uh -huh. So Uju is my niece, special family. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. So I just wonder, please, when you cook them, eh, uh -huh. make sure you give a very large portion to Uju. Uh -huh. uh -huh. I will. Okay. I will. Thank you, nice. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Thank you very uh -huh. much. Uh -huh. And uh, I hope you you started treating her like uh, your own daughter. Uh -huh. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> of course, you can verify from her. Oh, I trust you. Uh, Even this your smile is <laughs> telling me that you are telling me the truth. <laughs> uh, thank you, Nai. Okay, thank so you very let much, me be sir. going there. Eh? Okay. okay. Thank you very much, All sir. Right, uh, bye bye. Oh, bye. Bye bye, sir. Okay. Bye. Yes, bye. What are you doing here? I just feel for you. Hey, Joe, you shouldn't have come now. I'm suffering enough. Do you want to put me in more trouble? Sister, no. It's just that I've been feeling guilty. Because I know that your suffering today is because of me. Hey, you've been taking the blames. You've been receiving punishments that were even meant for me. Hey? I'm at peace today with my mother. It's all because of you. Nembikono. Eh? Just eat this food. The least I can do is bring food for you to eat. But you know what? If I eat this food, your mother will find out. She'll kill me. Don't worry. I will tell her that I'm the one that eats it. Just eat the food. I know you're hungry. Don't let my stress to go in vain. Mama will kill me. She will not know. If Water. 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 Mm -hmm. Thank you. It's now. Mm, it's me. I'm full already. You see that? It's very sweet, oh. Mama made it. Hmm. Not a cook. Sister, you're trying. How are you carrying all these blocks? Mm -hmm. It's not easy. But she has to finish this food now. Let's eat. I'll take the plates back. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
Babe, I really need money. I really need that money. How much? 5k. 5k? Yeah. Hey, babe, you can afford it now. What is 5k? No, now, babe, I did some job. They have not paid me yet. So I'm kind of broke. Ah, uh, broke for 5k? You're a big boy, baby. Stop, John. Why do you want to form my answer? Ah, babe, no, I'm serious. Seriously, if, you, if I don't pay that guy, the next embarrassment will be bloody big money. So, don't, don't wait to do now. Me! Raise 5k for you. From where? You know I'm not watching now. Ah. Thank you, Raymond. Huh? What for me, though? What are you saying? That you saw my daughter with a man kissing? I don't have water in my mouth. Biojugo. Are you sure it was my daughter you saw? Or my stupid um, stepdaughter? It's not in Gozika. Oh, in I know who I saw. You what? Caution your daughter. Caution her before she brings unwanted pregnancy to you. Sia! Zimokwa, clean your mouth. You did not say so. Biko, Biko, Biko. Stop using such language to describe my daughter again. I'll try it one again. Don't try it, or you go. Before they will say now, Kamaka has insulted somebody. Biko, but chal kwa anya. You know what I'm saying. And you know it's very, very possible if you don't contain her affairs with men. Hey, Nefu, if somebody hears you now, the person who will think your my daughter is a prostitute, get to keep her affairs with men. Eh? Okay, Nedu. Hey. Ha! Okamaka, I don't have strength to be kokwa. Let's stop this whole drama. Let's stop arguing. Hey, Remember, tomorrow is our women's meeting. And therefore, to be there. Okay? Mwanu, bye bye. Chiefu, you must see Golo Marcel. Yes, tomorrow is women's meeting. Jealous, see jealous, man. Because you don't have a daughter of your own. If you go and come to Chapo, Chapo, get a sale, I'll be back here. Of course, one will have some work. Nonsense. Okay, no, 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 I'm going to take it up with you, though. No, I'm not going to. How are you? See your mouth. How did you go? No, you know, I'm just asking. Okay, fine. This is the money. 
But I took it from under my mother's pillow. I stole it from my mother's pillow. I think it should be more than what you asked for. Babe, I asked for 5k. This is more than 5k. This is about 8k. Yeah. Oh, you're a darling. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. Life. I love you. I love so, you. So, yeah. please, make sure you give it to the person you're owing. I, I don't want anything to happen to you. No, it won't happen. No, you so. Ah, I don't even say anything. My God. Are you. I love so you. Key. I swear to God, I love I you. Love I love you, you so too. much. <laughs> Seriously, this is the reason. I tell people you need to have a girl like my girl. Oh. Yes, I always tell people like if you know the kind of girlfriend I have, man, you're an angel. Seriously, you're an angel. I told you. I told you it will work. It will work. You don't know these girls. They have money. They have money. Oh. <laughs> you said it. It do your agenda. See, when it comes to the ladies, leave it for a do. Now maybe a do for the girls. A do my one. You can die. I have you can dealt die. with a lot of ladies. You start, see, you start see yeah, let, me, let me tell you. It's supposed to be the ladies giving us money, not the other way around. The ladies have dealt with the men. This is our time to give the that? money back. I asked for 5k. This guy gave me more than 5k. Hey, <laughs> okay? Yeah, we'll give you more. Calm down. You if I follow your mother, I'm gonna steal from my no. mother. Calm down. You keep calm asking down. your guest friend for money. Calm so down. Go, let me take you out. Can take go get out. Eh? Take me out. I'll tell you now. Come on. Have you said to a reason? Have you given a reason this morning? Who's a reason? The debt you are owing now. You don't owe that. That is the name of a place, animal place. Nah, I can go here. Say I didn't say two. We said two. They go cap at like a guy. You are playing with fire. Are you eating or not? Are you going out or not? It's not like I don't want it's to not drink. Like when I be there, follow me, let's go. Okay? It's not like I don't go, want to drink. Go, go. I say I want to drink. Go, go back. I just don't want to drink. Don't be like say I want to drink, but I go still drink. Oh, come on, you better say to us. Ngazi, ne go, ne go. Okay, the key na abu. Ah. So it has gotten to this level that you go to my pot and you will even use the plate I use in eating. No. Dish food and start eating. No, 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 no. That wasn't how it happened. Hey, Zuku, how did uh, this happen? When I came back, hey. I was very, very hungry. Uju was around. She just saw that I was very hungry. Hey, yeah. So she brought out this food in this pot, with many small foods, and she gave me to eat. Is this what you're calling small food? Eh, mom, she gave you to eat. Yes, mama. As what? The person who cooked the food or the owner of the house because you're eating in the plate of the owner. No, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. The only person you should be sorry for is yourself. Hey. Because, eh? You will not eat anything in this house for one week. Hey! Kolo? Mama, in one week, one week is too much now. I'm going to disappear. This is more disappear! Let me just go and keep it. Come on, keep what? When you have you have already finished eating it. Now no it's a good near. Eh? Okay. Okay. Eh who? Eh eh. Oti Guayano. Look at this girl. Come and eat again, let me see. I go a burogi, let me see. Then I go jiwa. See food that I kept for my dog. Bro. My dog and my goat. Eh? I don't know if I'm going to be sure to go near. Oh, there's no point. Eh? She did not even eat only, oh, oh, only rice. I couldn't. Hmm? In my place. Mama, please now. Please, you know I'm your only beloved daughter. Oh. I don't care. I don't care. Give me my money. <laughs> Give me my money. The money I kept under my pillow. You're the only one that has access to my room. So, Biko, give me. Give me my money now. Mama, no, mom, it's your money. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> no, you're still lying. You're lying up here. No, 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 wait first, I'll confess, I'll confess, just wait first. Start your confession. The, the truth is that... That, 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 that I, I took the money, that, that I stole it. He said... That the truth is that I... I'm the thief. Of course, you know I will not believe that. 
Tipo, mama, you just don't know me very well. Kokwana. Please don't it. But mama, it was for a reason, you know. I, I, I broke my match and I just took rest of egg. And I didn't have any money on me to pay back, so I stole the money to pay my debt. You were the one who stole my money. And you were hiding there watching me. I almost killed my own child. Eh? Uh -huh. You stole my money up here. Yeah? And you have spent it. That's no problem. Eh? I want you to choose how you want to die. Hey! hey. Meanwhile, I'll be waiting for you inside. Oh, no, no, no. Okay? That's no problem. Please. But you didn't do it now. I, eh? I know, but I was watching. I couldn't just stay there and do nothing. She was going to hit you with that pistol. Yeah, but she won't kill me now. My child, she won't kill me. Why did you steal the money now? Why did you steal the money? Yeah, so what are we going to do now? What are we going to do? I don't know. I don't know. She's going to kill me. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! No, it has not gotten to this now. It has not gotten to this now. It will get to this now. Is it? Pourquoi <laughs> That stole your money and not her. What are you trying to do? Defend her? Mm -mm. I'm not defending her, Mama. You know, what, what will people say? It's not fair. What do you think people will say? Let them talk. If you do good, they will talk. You do bad, they will talk. Only you, Kulili. Let them talk. Napanya, don't be very careful. Be careful. Mama, I'm going to bring her back to this house. You will not stop me. You will not stop me. I'm going to bring her back. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Try it. Bring her back here. Eh? If he me me, he a matter than Benabo. Ofu boke. If I leave you, eh? Man, I'm a broke. I'm a your mother. Nonsense. Go and bring her back. <laughs> Ngozi, my daughter, my very beautiful daughter, please listen to what I'm about to tell you. It is obvious that my wife, your stepmother, is not happy that you are still staying with me in this house. I know that a lot of things has gone wrong, but I beg you, please, my daughter Ngozi, do not fight them back. Always love them as your blood family. I know one day for sure they will love you and accept you as their own blood family. 
I hope you understood what I said. Yes. Go. I'll be looking for you. Oh yeah, come, let's go. Ojuma, please just go home, okay? I don't want to see you. Go home. Manane, eh? You shouldn't have accepted the form. Yes. What you did was totally uncalled for. Honestly. Wow. This is what you have to say to me. So I should have just stayed there and done nothing. Watch mama call you a thief. Okuya? Oh, sorry. Uh, what did you even do with the money? Eh? I I gave the money to my boyfriend. I gave it to him so that he can solve some pressing issues. I you. you mean I'm going through this because of that good for nothing boy? Eh? Go bam 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 bam. Please, this one now I will not take it. Okay, I can't watch you stand there and insult my boyfriend. I don't like it. But well, that boy is a vagabond. Why do you keep letting him deceive you? Can't you see? Because stop. You're beginning to piss me off right now, and I don't like it. Hey. Yes, we are sisters, bonded by the same father. You're supposed to have my interest at heart, support me in everything I do. I don't even know why you don't even like Ebuka, just for no reason. Uh. Well, I am sorry, dear sister. I do not like him. I don't see anything good in that boy. Are you going with me or not? Have your mother permitted me to come back home? Really? Mm. Suit yourself then. Bye-bye. Well, Bye. Would you? Would you wait? You failed. You have no right to chase her. To chase her out of this house. Honestly. Ned. It's like you didn't hear what I said. She stole from me. And so what? It is not enough reason for you to send her back in. Out of her father's house. Remember. This is her father's house and she remains here until she gets married. I cannot harbor a thief in this house. Never. If that is the case, be ready to have a meeting with Ewe. Ewe? Yes. If he finds out, believe me, he will find you for that. I'm pleading with you, Kamaka. Please look for a way and bring that girl back to this house to avoid issues with the way. Please now, you know what I'm talking about. Okay. Her Excellency, I should greet you. No, no. I should greet good, you. Good afternoon, Mama. The only reason I brought you back to this house is because I don't want to have issues with the Igwe. If not, you will die and your corpse will get rotten outside. Hold your ears. Come on, hold your ears on a quincy. Hold them well. As long as you are in this house, you will not eat my food. You will not drink my water. You will not use anything that belongs to me. I hope you're hearing me. You're listening, Abby. Yes, ma'am. And from today, your name has changed. To all your 
you are on your own. You heard me? Good. Uh -huh. Another, another thing. Very important. Don't greet me again here. Mm -hmm. Your greeting nauseates me. Only remember Abu Anaro. Keep your greeting to yourself. Did you hear me? Okay, Mama. Did you hear me? Yes, Mama. Don't forget, to oh, Don't make any mistake. Yes, Mama. You try to call no. Thank you, Mama. Stop crying. I promise I'll make her change her mind. Okay, it won't be as difficult as you've seen it now. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you for your help. So long I'm here, it's fine. Are you mad? Something wrong with your head. Nezuzu, Nezuzu. Is something wrong with your head? Is that why you slapped me? Is something wrong with your head? I think there's, there's something definitely wrong with you. You just were about touching women. What is wrong with you? Eh? Is that why you slapped me? Yes. Look, there's somebody that I'm even trying to help. Eh? I'm trying to help you. Me? I would have dumped your sister and married you. Hey. Hey, Ibuka. So this is what you do? This is what you go about to this village, deceiving young girls that you will marry them, okay? Ebuka, big boy, kid, that's the I don't even have, have anything to say to you. It's my sister that I blame. You that you want to marry, marry yourself. Come on, cut out. Have you fed yourself? Cut away, you. Cut away. God bless you, man. The next time you touch me again, I'll put my hand to your eyes. Yeah, yeah. Come on, get away. Look at look at this. 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 Cut away! Cut out! So you mean my boyfriend has been making passes at you? Would you not want? Not why? Multiple times? Are you just telling me? Don't really? Understand me? Eh? Understand what? I didn't want to make you angry. I am very disappointed. Yes, you know, at least kept it to yourself now because right now I am angry. Come, come, come now. Do wait no, no. first now. Wait, let me. You know, I will never want to intentionally make you angry. Would you? Hello, one now. You did the right thing by bringing her back home. That was a very difficult thing for me to do. It's you. Okay, yes. It's still the right thing. It's the right decision. All you should be thinking of is how to get her a suitor. Yes, they will ask her how to marriage. After that, she will no longer be part of your life. Hey! I cannot wait. It's the right yeah. thing to do. That's the right thing to do. So, then, then. Do you know of any man who is looking for a wife? Can you say about a bit of a call to be your sister? Oh, my camera, my camera. Ah, ah. Take it easy now. Oh, my God. 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 When the time comes, she'll go. Okay. Still, I can do it. I'm going to be able to work for you. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you make passes at my sister? Me? Yes! Me, Ebuka? Where did you get that from? What is wrong with you? How can you be this terrible? I thought you loved me. Wait, I don't, I'm not getting the whole thing. 
Where are you getting those information from? That's what My I'm sister confessed to me. She told me you've been making advances at her for a long time now. How, oh, babe? You slapped me for an information you've not confirmed. Your sister just lied against me and you slapped me for such. My sister cannot lie to me and I believe her. Wait, babe. You don't believe me, right? Me, Ebuka? Babe, like seriously, is that why you slapped me? What, what are you saying? No, 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 what's the meaning of this one now? Are you pretending or what? What do you mean, babe? I've not even... Okay, let me just open up to you, babe. As a matter of fact, your sister has been the one making advances on... And I just thought there's no need for me to create issues between two sisters. I'm... Kai, Ebuka, God, what, what... I'm telling you, if you want me to swear, I'll swear with anything. I've not even... Me, Ebuka, your sister. That she's more beautiful than your what? Come on, babe. Seriously, is that why you slapped me? I'm here. Ngozi. How dare you lie to me? Lie to you? How dare you? You're such a betrayer. Hey. So this has been your plan all along? Huh? To rob me of my man, right? Juma, what are you saying? I don't understand. Look at me thinking that you are my blood. Thinking that you are an angel. My mother saw through you. You? She saw through this, this pretentious, innocent face. Me? Yes! Huh. I regret ever trusting you. Juma, how can you say something like this to me? After all I have done for you, this is what you say to me. What have you done? What? You took blames that I never solicited for? Huh? Did I ask you to take those blames for me? Did I? Do not speak to me like that. Huh? Do not speak to me like that. Oh, please. Stop those crocodile tears. Those deceitful tears don't even touch me anymore. You brought the bomb, madam, honestly speaking. And I hate you right now. Please, let me tell you something. Don't you ever come close to me again henceforth. You hear me? Don't you ever come close to me again. Witch. Don't you? Wolf in sheep clothing. Ah, would you confess hey. us? What did I do? Wolf in sheep clothing. Me, Gossi. Papa, this is your fault. This is all your fault, Papa. It's just to make you happy. All I think every day is about your well being. Nemoko, uh -uh. <laughs> Nem, I've come to you as a helpless and motherless child. Nem, I was eight years old when I lost my mother. My father held my hands and brought me to you. He introduced me as his daughter. And ever since that day, I have loved you and seen you as my only mother. But you, on the other hand, you've hated and despised me so much. You have refused to accept me as your daughter. Maybe it's about something that transpired in the past. Maybe my mother or my late father offended you. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's me. Maybe I keep doing something wrong and I am not aware of it. Whatever it is, please. I have come to ask you to please find a place in your heart and forgive Forgive this child of yours. Just forgive me and accept me in your life, please. 
I'm begging you. I love you so much. Is this what you have come to tell me? Eh? They be call him history. Ah, Koseka. My husband deceived me. He deceived me into believing I was his first love. I never knew he had already impregnated his classmate. Eight years after, when she died, he stupidly brought you to me. Telling me the truth. And that day I swore that nothing will ever make me like you. That as long as I live, you will never have peace. But this is not any fault of mine. I never asked to be brought to this house. Eh? But he brought you. He brought you because traditionally you were supposed to be raised here. I've told you my mind. Nothing will ever make me see you as my child because you are not. Biko, don't spoil my day. Just let me enjoy my, my small, small mangoes in peace, Biko. <laughs> What is my crime? What did I do wrong? Oh, I missed you a lot, bro. I missed you too. You know I love you, too. And I love you too. You sure? Come on, give me a I missed you so much. I missed you too. Hey, Buka! Hey, Buka, what are you doing? Oh, babe, this my girlfriend. Okay, babe, this is Gineka. My prison girlfriend. This was, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Hey, Buka, I caught you with a girl, and this is what you, this is what you say to me. I don't get it. You think I've been stupid or been blind all this while? You think I don't know that you have more than two boyfriends? Oh God, hey, Buka, you, you actually think I'm stupid, right? I don't understand. What is it you don't understand? Jesus. You're pretending now that you don't know that I know that you know that I know that you know that you have more than one boyfriend. So now I should. I beg, mean, see. Uh... How dare you? Are you stupid? How dare you? You slap me. And I'll slap you again. I swear to God, eh? if not for one thing, hey, me, Ibuka, I would have bundled you out here without. Try it again. Babe, wait. No, if not for one thing, I swear to God, I would have slapped the hell out of you. Are you okay? Ibuka, I've suffered. Slapping me for what? Think I don't know all the things you've been doing. Think I'm stupid. Ah, uh, these tears this is not easy today. We started seeing tears. All right, babe, come on, let's go. Next time, try and slap me. What I will do to you, eh? If not for one thing, I know why. You are grateful. Listened to you. 
I, I, I thought you were lying and you, you were jealous of me. I would never ever <laughs> lie to you, would you? I want what's best for you. But you have to stop crying. You see, God will judge him. As a matter of fact, it's his loss. You're a very beautiful woman. So he has just lost a very beautiful woman. Don't cry, don't mind me. He slapped me. Is he? <laughs> Omar Amakanti. He slapped me and told me that I am not good for him. Chelukwao. Ebuka raised his hands and he landed on your cheek. Yes. He slapped you. Don't, just clean your eyes. I'll be right back. Yeah. He slapped you. Yeah. Okay. I sacrifice all for you. Yet you're not satisfied. I took blames for your sake. Yet you're not satisfied. I carried your cross. What? Ah, what's this one? Uh, let me see what What's this now? I can't you stand if I stand up here. Yeah. You will not do it. If people can stand up, I will kill somebody. I will kill somebody. Uh, one, I'll count three. One. Nonsense. He thinks he's the only one that is smart. Next time you lay your hand on my sister, I will, I will remove his. I will remove his teeth. Idiot. Don't mind him. Sister. What is it again? Sister, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the way I spoke to you. Please, Barum, Pico. Hey, if you stand up. Pico. Stand up. How can you be kneeling for your own sister? Who am I that you are kneeling down for? I know I really hurt you. I don't deserve to be called your sister. You deserve to be called my sister and more. You are my beloved sister. And I love you so much. Does that mean you've forgiven me? Of course, yes. I have forgiven you. Come <sighs> here. <laughs> you know when you were angry, I knew you said those hurtful words out of anger and you didn't mean them. I forgive you. Oh? Thank you. <laughs> My baby. <laughs> <laughs> Did you beat him? Ha! Ah! Hi, welcome to my house. Now nah, welcome, Thank oh. You. Hey, no, no. Nezi, no, oh. Thank you. Ngazi! Mama! Wetaji! Oh! Hey, no, no, we can. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. No, no. Uh, thank you. And she still want. She still want. Uh, no, no, cola. We have cola. Thank you, ma. Have a good day, Oji. But before we call this cola, mm. I want to introduce this young man I came with. Okay. His name is Fred. Is a businessman based in Asaba. Uh, he recently lost his father. Yeah, sorry. Mm. No. He was a business mogul. And uh, he said to take over his business, his father's business empire, <laughs> as a CEO. Uh -huh. mm. So, Fred, meet my bosom friend, Okamaka. Nice to meet you, Mom. No, oh, welcome. Yes, welcome. Ah, he's a fine boy. Always. Oh, Jesus, I'm a big one. Fred, did you like what you said? Yes, Auntie, she's perfect. I know you will like it. She's yes. perfect. <laughs> Ned. Ned. <laughs> I can see you have done your own work. Well. Don't you trust me? Mm -hmm. I trust you. I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you. Now I'll just say so you're fine. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Ned, Ned. Oh. Oh my God. Thank you very much, man. Thank you. Man. Thank you. Man. So, um, tell me about yourself. Um, little things about you, your education. Um. I lost my father when I was 10 years old. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. It's okay. Uh, presently, I'm in SS2, oh. secondary school. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a, well, well done. Well done. So, um, do you have any 
sibling? Yes, yes, I have a younger sister. Oh. Her name is Uju. She's very beautiful. Uh -uh. There she is. Uju, your hair is fine. Good day, beautiful. How are you? I'm fine, sir. My name is Fred. Oh, nice to meet um, you. Please, you can call me Fred instead of Disa, okay? Okay, sir. <laughs> okay. Who is he? He's a friend of mine. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> All right. Bye, okay. Bye Roger. Yes. Your sister is actually beautiful. Yes. <laughs> very beautiful. Um, so tell me, what do you do for a living? Uh, I am a businessman. Oh, <laughs> that young man is seeking your sister's son in marriage. What? Like a book of words. It's nothing. Okay. <laughs> Auntie, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. What's going on? Am I still your daughter? Or are you now seeing Gozi in me? I don't understand. How? Okay. I am talking about the young man that came asking for Ngozi's hand in marriage. Fred. Yes. Mama. How can you see something good coming into this family and you decided to divert it to somebody else? Don't I deserve something good? Your own daughter. I still cannot get your point. <sighs> Mother, that man came asking for Ngozi's hand in marriage. Mm. And you decided to give it to her, that rich man. You decided to give it to Ngozi instead of me. Your only daughter. I thought you wanted the best for me. Of course. You are my beloved child. And I will do everything to make you happy. Now, sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Ne? Hmm? I just want you to be happy. You see that what is going on? Forget it. I'm, I've been looking for a way to get rid of that girl. So that we will have our lives to ourselves. So I started telling all my friends, including Ned, to look for any kind of man. Any man, my bricklayer, my carpenter. Let, let them come and marry her off. I didn't know that Ned would bring a man as rich as Fred. Eh? But it's okay. Hmm? Let him marry her. Let her go. Go. Hi. Mama. If not that your name was written in my birth certificate, I would have said you're not my mother. Uh -uh. That is, maybe you adopted me. Because I don't understand. Mother, did you see the car that man brought to this house? Did you see the car? Did you see how fresh he is looking? That man was this of money. Mama, that man, Diego. And you want to give it to Ngozika. Why would you calm down? A better man will come. A richer man will come. A fresher man. A finer man will come for you at the right time. Leave Ngozi to go. Oh? Let her just go. Let her carry her problems and go. Don't worry. Your own will come at the right time. Oh? Mama, what if he doesn't come? Hey! How can you be this negative now? Eh? When he will come. Your own way, come. No, huh? Mama, mba, mba. I need to have that man. See, Fred. Fred is mine. I need to have him. No, 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 no. No, more go quality. Mm. Because he's coming in a few days. Fungus. 
Mama, you will do something about it. Gene? You will do something about it. There's nothing I can do. I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do. Biko. Let her just go. Let her go. Ah. You are worthy, she bloated. Uh, you are part that cause get black. I sacrifice all for you. Yet you're not satisfied. There you are. What do you want? Food is ready. Come on, eat. I'm not hungry. I know. But you've been like this since morning. You can't remain like this. You have to eat food. Ngozi, please leave me alone. Leave me alone. Go and serve Mama the food. After you are now her favorite daughter. You both of you should just leave me alone. I don't want you people in my life anymore. Hey, Ujunwa. It is me you are talking to. Your sister. Don't say that. Now it's not fair. What is not fair is Mama giving you to a man that rightfully belongs to me. But he came for me. That's not true. Mama gave him to you. You can't fool me. Mama chose him for you. You want the man, right? Yes, I want him. Do you know how I, I always want what's best for you? Anything to make you happy. You can have him. <laughs> you will leave him for me? Of course. <laughs> Come on, would you? <laughs> thank you. You don't have to thank me. Whatever makes you happy makes me happy. So tell me, are you going to eat now? You requested for a meeting. Uh, yes, Boris. Uh, I'm true to inform you that I'm getting married soonest. Wow. Yes. This really sounds pretty good. I'm really happy for you. You see, it has always been my wish that you take the title of the CEO of your late father's company. Mm -hmm. Rather than your younger brother, Osita, trying to take that position from you simply because you don't have a wife and a child of your own. Thank you, Barista. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your support. Don't mention I'm only doing my job here. You need to hurry up with the marriage ceremony, get your wife pregnant. To further interest you on this, your younger brother has been coming here demanding for his right. And I, your late father and I both agreed. I told him the will cannot be read until after five years, mm. as your father and I have signed. So you need to do all that you needed to do, so you can take the title and position of the CEO of your late father's company. Simply because you don't have a wife of your own, that's why Hosita has been making frantic effort to take this position from you. I've, I've heard all you said, um, Barrister, and. Um, it's guardian, please. And once again, I want to say thank you. At least for all your support and standing by me. I don't, I don't take it for granted. You're welcome. I'm only doing my job. Thank you very much. Same here, my brother. Mama, I have decided to give up on my chances of marrying Fred and let Ujunwa here marry him instead. Huh? This is beautiful. I didn't know you were going to say this. Ah, my daughter. Mama. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. You know, but Mama, this will only happen if you permit it. I have permitted. Eh. I have permitted. Because I know you want me to marry Fred. But Ujunwa here said she wants him. So let her have him. Chai. You tried. Eh? Hey. I never expected you to say this. I've been thinking of how to present this thing to you. Don't take it again. Oh, um, yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're happy now? Yes, Mama. I'm happy. My sister is the best sister in the whole world. Oh, um, um, she <laughs> hey, is. Mama, the biggest problem you have now is what are we going to tell Fred when he comes? It's very easy now. Make yourself unavailable. Mm -hmm. If he does not see you anymore, eh? He will not have any other option but to, to settle for your sister. You're right, Mama. You got to go? You're right. <laughs> 
Be a good girl. Thank you. You have done well. Thank you, Mama. Chai. Sister, thank yeah. you. You're lucky to have a kind of sister like you. Because Very go. lucky. I love you. Chai. I love you too. <laughs> Chai. Thank you. Yes, Mama. Mama? Hmm? Mama, I don't understand. What do you mean by she left the house? Hmm. My dear. You know, I I did not tell you much about her. Sometimes she behaves like somebody whose brain is not functioning well. Uh -uh. Uh, somebody who whose battery has been removed. When a weber score score. Mama, please explain to me. I really don't get what you're saying. Okay. Like I said, it's hard to carry a mama. She woke up one morning and told me that um, she's going to her mother's place. Just her, like that. Her mother's place? Uh, uh, wait, are, are you know her mother? <laughs> no, I'm her stepmother. Uh, you see that um, one beside you there? She is the only biological child I have. And she's ready to be a better replacement. Nah, it took me time to convince her. You understand? So that you will not be disappointed. Are you coming here, Biko? Uh, yeah. You are a very handsome man. It will be a pleasure becoming your wife. And I promise you, I will love you for the rest of my life. Chai. Mmm. Kebo. And see, I was actually surprised when she told me Ngozi is no longer living with them. I was surprised as well. Oh, I don't just understand. She even offered me her other daughter as an alternative. But the truth is, this Ngozi I won't. I understand. Ujuma is prettier than Ngozi. That's why she's the better option for you. You think so? It's what I know, not what I think. <laughs> Besides, you know why you're getting married to her in the first place? Until you're right, I guess I would have to begin the whole marriage right as soon as possible. I knew I, would, I could always count on you. <laughs> <laughs> I would always do it for you. Uh, what it's else? okay, it's okay. In my mind is calm now since you are on my side. <laughs> <laughs> I'll always be. Alright, all right, no problem. Let's, let's just go. So, um, as you can see, this is my humble boat. Yeah, the place is so fine. You like it? Yes, so I love it. <laughs> like a paradise, so big and fine. Huh? Mama, see what you almost made me miss? Eh? I hope you're giving him food. Good food though. He's fine, he's fine. I just finished, I'm um, serving him breakfast now. The only way to a man's heart is through food. And um, the other room, eh, <laughs> Otago? Of course, Mama, we had fun last night. 
Uh. <laughs> Mama, I gave him fire to fire in the other room. Don't you trust your daughter again? I trust you. <laughs> yes, Mama. Uh. Money. Yeah. The one my in-law gave me, that huge money he gave me, I've not even touched it. Uh, but if you still want to bring another one, bring it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget everything I told you. Would you? Would you? Oh, bye bye. Mm. Greet my in law. Oh, oh my, is that would you want name? How is she doing? You are started again. Ah! What is it? Are you mad? Chimo, did you drink? Mama, did not drink. I love you very much. I love come you. on, call Elise. Hey, Mama, Mama, you're very beautiful. You even touched me with that dirty hand. Yeah, it's true. My hands are dirty. I'll wash them. Say, Mama, Mama, because... Manaria. Golden woman. Mwah. Mwah. Mama, I'll see you in the corner. Hey, hey, hey. Look at me, Tomaka. Starting when now? Uh-uh. I love, lo I love you. I love you, Gunoni. You know, love you, go on with you. For the truth, I don't know how to cook. What? Yes, I only assist my sister because in, in the kitchen. So she's the one that knows how to cook. Um, okay. That's my problem. At least you opened up and I'll teach you and how to cook. Really? Yeah. Thank you. I feel so ashamed of myself. No, no. I mean, there's nothing to feel ashamed about. You could also send me lots of videos on YouTube on how to cook local and international dishes. So even when I'm not around, you could try out some things. Yeah. Okay? I love you. I love you too. But this, let's take it out. Sorry. <laughs> So what you both you eat the food? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, okay. So how's your new wife? Hold up. That one is a no-go area. Hold one over. You believe that girl can help you? Excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? What's really wrong with girls of nowadays? You know, with their parental upbringing. Cannot cook. I hear they claim to be Gen Z. Gen Z bodies. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Ah. Uh -huh. Look, uh, see. see. I think she's taking to a good restaurant for me to have a meal. Because I was actually thinking I'll get back home to have something good, but now. Uh, I need to work on That's no problem. At least you can tell it to us. That is the main thing now, right? Don't eh? <laughs> no worry, I'll take you to somewhere good so you can have it. I trust you. I try to see us the one. That is it. No, I have, I have, I have, I have short plug for good food. I trust you. Hey, go see what No, if I don't have water, I don't eat. I can get choked. What kept you so long? I, I, I. You m m m m. Just take it easy. Let me even yeah. see the water she brought. Jesus! 
Ah, what? I said that to bring cold water for you. Obute Milioko, for what? No, no, it's... Um, it's it's okay. what? I sent you to bring cold water. Uh, and you brought hot water. Mama, it's not hot if water. I want, if I had wanted him to drink hot water, Melia, see. Eh? It's not hot what is this now? Oh, this is not hot What is wrong with you? Ah. Ah. What is this now? Ah. Eh? What's the problem? Uh, Why are you pouring water? Water? Okay, you say the water is hot, and you are pouring uh, the, the water. You want to burn her? What? Why are you this wicked now? What's your problem? Why has she done wrong? Uh, uh, why are you shouting at me? Why wouldn't I shout? As what? What did she do wrong? If somebody hears your voice now, the way you're shouting, uh, they will think I'm wicked. Oh, what so you is don't this know that now? you're wicked, eh? You don't know? It's not fair. Oh. It's no, not no, fair, oh. it's not fair. It is black. Bia Okoye, what is your problem? Eh? If you don't like the way I'm treating her, please come and carry her. Go. Exactly, I want to take her away. Take her away? Ah! After all, is she supposed to be living with me? I'll get it here, I will be able But what is wrong with you? Why are you this wicked and harsh on this poor girl? Why? Biko, not on top of the food I gave you. Which food? This if you, one? If you don't want to eat, Biko, you're happy here. Pamoe! Stay, so. Otale Pamoe with her. Look at it. Pepper Stop spitting inside one. now. I am not going to eat ah. it. Don't say it. So I that I'll be able sense. to eat it. What is it? Nonsense. Ah. It's inside the food. Kamli Wonya. Go, Biko. Ah. That's not I don't blame you. Is it not because yeah, I killed yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Idiot. Nonsense. Nonsensible. Ngozi. Uncle. Look. I've been asking you. As a matter of fact, I'll be begging you to come and live with me. Eh? I don't know why you're refusing. You know very well that I can take good care of you. But what is she doing for you that I cannot do? Apart from her wickedness. Eh? Oh, uncle, please. Try to understand. Huh? I have come to take her as my own mother, so I can't leave her. She's not your mother, and she will never be your mother. What ah. the, the thing is, she's wicked. Uh, uncle, she, she's not like that, so, and it's not as if I'm enjoying her wickedness. But I love her so much. Hey. You won't understand. You know that she's wicked, but you love her so much, and you want me to understand. So meaning that you are enjoying her wickedness. No, 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 not at all, sir. I am not enjoying her wickedness. Only that Uncle Benito does wickedness. Deep down in her heart, she's a good person. Huh. She is. It's just that um, I'm praying for her. She will change. Go see. Go. Hi. Look, this is your decision, eh? Rethink it, oh. Rethink it. This woman is wicked. There is nothing to enjoy in it. Eh? Please. She will damage you, oh. Anyway, um, what is your name? Gozika. Gozika. What is the meaning in English? Blessings. Blessings. I pray to Chi that he brings a man that can wipe away your tears. I can see the tears in you. You are just holding back. Okay? Please. Thank you, sir. Okay, I'm going home. Okay, sir. Safe journey. Hey. Huh. Okay, I'm fine. Okay. Hello. Yeah. Um. Check your phone. I just sent you two million naira. Yeah. So you could get yourself a new phone, change of clothes, accessories. 
Two million naira. Yeah, two million. Baby, you sent me two million naira. Hey! <laughs> Baby, thank you. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Where is my phone? Tell me, oh, you're so calm down. down. <laughs> calm down, I just need to change the phone. Let's need to million. change your phone. I've always mm -mm. had a dream of, you know, having a girl child first. You're so weird. Most men would want a boy. Well, I'm not most men, but. Whichever way, I just want to have a child, you understand, so that I can take care of him or her and give them the best life. I know. know. <laughs> I know you can. And I know you will. I mean, take a look at the way you're taking care of me. I love you. You deserve the very best, my love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is your late father's will. And this will or testament can only be read on the event of my first son getting married. Which is what I've done, Barista. So please, you can go ahead. Okay, can you just calm down and let the Barista read the damn will? Uh, wait, I don't understand. Why are you raising your voice at me, though? I said you should calm down and let the Barista read the fucking will. What did you just say to me? Can Shut you the fuck up. Just keep yourself together. I mean, coordinate yourself right here. Else I'm going to walk you both out of my office. We can't go on with this with this act of disrespect and disregard for me. <laughs> Listen, I know you don't like me, okay? That's why you're using such words on me. But thank God you're not my father. Hmm? So I will get whatever I deserve from his properties. Hmm? You can't stop that. You know, go. Where so go on. Parista, ignore stupid things that are coming out of my youngest brother's mouth. It's obvious he's gone in for my inheritance. Please, you can. Continue. Please, I can understand. I just need you both to put yourself together. And allow me to read this well, please. We can go on with this act of disrespect and disregard for me. Is it not so obvious that he bribed the lawyer? Hmm? I mean, he was bent on making your brother the, the CEO. You know, at first I shared the same thought with you. Not until I thoroughly scrutinized the will myself. It was handwritten, and the handwriting I saw on that will was that of my late father. Did your father hate you that much that he wants your brother to become the CEO? No, 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 no my love. Then what? I just think he loved his first son. But that's so unfair. That's unfair. Hmm? Not to worry, my love. Hmm? If God says I will be CEO, then definitely it will come to pass. Because you will. Definitely you will. Because when he was supposed to get married, he didn't. So he will regret his actions. Okay? Come. Oh. Let me put it to you, okay? Oh. You have to do it, okay? I just can't wait to become the CEO of a Foka construction company. Don't yeah. worry. You will. I can't wait for you to become the CEO. <laughs> yeah. Oh. It's okay. Cool. Yeah. Babe. Hey, baby. Mm -hmm. Baby, wake up. Mm -hmm. Baby, wake up now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Babe, come. Let's do it again. Again. Let's have sex again. No. We already had three rounds already before I slept off. Look how funny you are. See, a lot, a lot is at stake here. Eh? Baby, can you just get, can you get pregnant for me? Hmm? Please. Maybe I know now. I know. I will get pregnant, but please take it easy on me. I am, but eh? look. I will lose my CEO title to my younger brother if I don't get to work. Your CEO title? Mm -hmm. I thought your dad willed all that to you already. Only if I have a child. So please. Let's get to work, okay? <laughs> come, come. Mm. 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 
Ты на 30 зоне заставил. This is really weighing you down. You need to calm down. Sam, you don't, you don't tell me I need to calm down. Eh? Why has God chosen to embarrass me this way? At all. God has not chose to embarrass you. Everything happened in his own time and season. God has made everything fine and beautiful. This is not beautiful. There's nothing beautiful about this whole situation. I mean, it's the third day in our marriage and still nothing. Nothing. Have you been to a gynecologist? <laughs> I've been to the best gynecologist in the country. And what else do you have to tell me? That I and my wife were in good condition. Still nothing. <clears throat> Could this be spiritual? I'm thinking so. I'm really thinking to that point because I have a feeling Ken's hand is in this whole thing. You know, and this is pursuit of the CEO uh, position. Exactly. I have a feeling. Now you can get the points. Because if his hands are not in this, then he ought to have left the position for the CEO for you. Exactly. If he truly respects you and loves you as his elder brother, he should allow it for you. You just seem not to understand. Eh? You really need to be careful because this is not getting funny at all. It's not. <laughs> What have I done? What have I done to deserve this? Hmm? Why, why, why are my village people treating me like this? They don't want my progress. What have I done? I think I know who is behind this. I think I know who is doing this. You know who is doing this? Who? My brother, I mean, he's the only one that doesn't want me to have the position of the CEO. Your brother. What, what have I done to him that will make him hurt me so much like this? What have I done to him? I don't know. I'm not even sure if he's the one, but he's looking over yours. 
I have just two years. Two years to have a child or lose everything. Two years. Yeah, two years. God. God, what is all this? What is all this? It's okay. It's okay. What, baby, what do we do? It's okay. Calm down, okay? Why, why is everything happening this way? What have we done? Just calm down. Everything will be fine. Here is water. Which water? I want you to drink water. Did I ask for water? You've been worried. You've been pacing up and down, and I'm worried too. Yeah. Eh? What is the problem? Are you owing somebody money? You can tell me. I will work extra to pay the person. Eh? So Okamaka cannot have a moment of peace in her own house. Eh? What is this now? I'm not as. Just leave me alone. I want to be left alone, please. Ma, I cannot leave you alone. Look at your face. You look worried. Just tell me what the problem is. Hi. My enemies have finally got me through my daughter, Ujumwa. Eh? Hey! Mama, is Ujumwa in trouble? In trouble? Is someone looking for her trouble? Just mention the person's name. Now let me get to the city and deal with that person. How can somebody be looking for my Shut up! It's your... Shut up! You know what I'm not I can't make you like what is it? Because they can do me a favor. Anything. Go and sit down on that chair and shut up. Let me talk. Go. I want to think. Go and sit down. Mama, you need to sit down. You've been worried. Eh? You've been worried. Go and sit down. I will slap you. Go and sit down. Ah. I thought you said your sister Ngozi ran away from the house. Eh, um, but she's back. Ah, good for her. Why, why are you even telling me about her though? I'm telling you about her because I want you to take her in as your second wife. What? Would you? What are you saying? Baby, it's obvious I can't give you a child. But my sister Ngozi can. <coughs> hey, would you? Would you please refrain from such conversations with me? Where's this coming from? Baby, please try and understand me now. Eh? I want you to cling to that CEO title. I don't want you to lose it because you deserve it. Please. I don't want this whole child issue to stop you from taking what rightfully belongs to you. Don't let your brother take it away, please. Ah. <sighs> Obin, I beg you, Bikono, please. Even if I want a woman to give me a child, it's definitely not your sister now. Be please, it has to be my sister, Ngozi. It has to be her. She's the only one I can trust. Please. Hey. Eh? I wouldn't let a strange woman come into my home to destroy it. No. It's Ngozi that I want. She'll be the one to give you a child. I trust her. Obin, Bikono, please. It's okay. Come. Yeah, come. You'll give me a child in due time. Hmm? I want you to be a CEO. I will. I will. <laughs> you Mama said she has told you everything I've been going through. She did. You won't believe I am you and your sister. I am still unable to have my own child after three years of marriage. Hey, what kind of problem is this? Don't worry. God, what kind of thing is this? My sister does not deserve this. You're a very nice person. This shouldn't be happening to you. You should go and happen to someone else, not you. Amen. But I have to be realistic. 
My husband is at the verge of losing his inheritance. Eh? Yes. Mm. According to his father's will, he has to produce a child before five years. My God. This is the third year. This is the third year. You just have two years left. You know what? There is nothing God cannot do. You can still give your husband a child. I believe God. God will not put you to shame. Amen. I believe him too. But as it stands now, my husband is ready to do anything to make sure he doesn't lose his inheritance. Including getting a second wife. Eh? Yes, since I can't give him a child. Hey! No, God will not allow it to happen. It's God that gives children now. It's I, not your fault. I know. I know, Mana. As it stands now, he is already on it. Ah. He is on it. Eh? We just have two years left. Two years. That is why I came. That is why I am here to plead with you, my lovely sister. One name Biko. My help. Would you just say the word? Anything at all. I would, you know I will give my life for you if I have to. Okay. I... I won't... This is difficult. Uh, Mom, let me help you. Ngo. Mama. Mwamu. Mama. Isibu Mwamu. Mama. What your sister is trying to say is that it will be a shame and dishonor to her if her husband goes outside and brings in a total stranger as a co-wife. When that woman gives him a child, she will start insulting her. She will start antagonizing her. So she prefers to have someone she calls her blood to be her co-wife. And who else is her blood? If not you. Me? Yes, my lovely uh, sister. Biko. Please. No, no. Help no. me. No, no. Marry my husband. And give him a child, please. No, 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 no. I can't I can't I can't do that. That's Mama, this is this is wrong. This is going to be disrespectful and it will be a dishonor to you, my sister. Mm -mm. I cannot. Mm -mm. No. It won't. I will be very comfortable knowing that it is my blood yes. that is doing this for me and not some stranger that will take over my home. Mm -hmm. Please. Mama. You know I have never begged you for any favor before. Do this for me. A single favor. Go on, Mama, please don't cry now. Please. No, I can't stand you too. I can't stand your tears, Mama. Do you want me to kneel down? I can't do that. Actually, we can't. Mama, Mama, no, no, Mama, please. Be cool, Mama. Be cool. So that people will not start laughing at us. Don't all. cry. I cannot stand you to cry. Please don't cry for me. And what did she say? She. She accepted. Oh. <laughs> she mm. loves me so, so much. She can do anything for me. She don't look happy. You should know that it will never be my intention to marry two wives. I know. I know, but it's, it's, it's not your fault. Okay? Life happened. It won't be easy for me to. But I just want the best for you. I just want you to be happy. Isn't that what you want? You would. You would always be my first in the world. Okay? Thank you.
Thank you, sir. 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 No, I'm very comfortable with you, sir. Yeah. Me, I'm comfortable with calling you, sir. Oh. <laughs> uh, it's all right. No, no problem then. Um, my love, mm -hmm. I would quickly go in and freshen up, okay? Uh, baby, hmm? not without your new wife now. Eh? Take her upstairs. Get things rolling already. Uh, but she's just coming in. She has to settle in at least. Settle her in in your room. Take her to go and settle her in. Uh -uh. Sis, I should. You have my permission. Follow him. Hmm? Follow him and go and freshen up in the room. He will take you to go and freshen up. <laughs> Just promise me that you will not disappoint me. No, Mban, I, I won't. Are you sure? Okay, I trust him. Mban, stand up. Shall we? I hope you like the place. It's fine, I know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know, you're so sweet. <laughs> Thank you. And it's surprising. You're still a virgin. I mean, I'm like your sister. Well, I decided to remain celibate until I get married. Mm. Besides, virginity is not a yardstick to judge a virtuous woman, is it? Oh, well, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're right. Oh. Um, can I go now? Are you done? So that I can leave the room for my sister. <laughs> you know, you're such a sweet soul. And hey, look, I promise you, I would always treat you right, okay? I would never treat you as a bad wife. Trust me. And may anything happen to me if I do otherwise. Please don't swear. I trust you. I believe you. Go. Oh. Ukamaka, Okoye, what came over you? No, no, really, what's your problem? Huh? How could you approve of two sisters getting married to the same man? How? Who told you they got married? Huh? No, no, no. Who said she married him? Who? She just went there to rescue her sister from marriage crisis. I see. Huh? Marriage crisis. Oh, say, Marka. So she's a rescuer. Huh? I mean, what is wrong with you? Why are you this wicked? Uh -uh. Yes, no. And I heard that you organized some elders and collected her bride price. And no, what? Before? No, 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 no. Before? Huh? Was I not the one that took care of her when her parents died? So I deserve. Her bride price. Mm. Mm. And you forget that that is an abomination, right? Okay. You are making a deal to the gods. It's all right. Look, I don't care. Whatever you took from that man, I don't care. You will return my, my niece in peace as she was. I mean, what is wrong with you? What has she done to you that you've decided to wreck her life? Which, huh? which one is wrecking again? Okay, okay, why are you just jealous and bitter? I'm uh, jealous. Yes! Did I not give that child to you when her parents died? You rejected her. No point of correction. <laughs> I wanted to take her. Mm. She refused. She chose you over me. Are we not saying the same thing? <laughs> Whether you rejected her or she chose me, are we not saying the same thing? I raised her. Therefore, I should collect a bright price. Ah, and it's all right. Continue to arrogate powers to yourself. And you are going to meet my kinsmen. You are going to pay for all this nonsense you're doing. 
Just what? Hey, chelu, Hold on, hold on. Hold on for let what? Me, hold me, on for what? Let me give you transport fare. Go be hey. Hey, I oh? Can you get go? Hey. You suffered. You! You, this wretched woman, you want to give me transport? Oh. It's alright. We shall see! Alright. Because, Jeve, we cannot see anything. What are we seeing? Then, Lele, Lele, Lele. Happy one day, happy you. Oh, my collect bright friends. You want to reap where you did not sow. Can no one each other out? You are worthy, sheep, blood in you. You are worthy, sheep, blood in you. You are part that cause get black. went to the hospital and we discovered that she's pregnant. What? She's Guinea? She's pregnant. Hey! God! You are good! Hey! Where, where, where is she? I guess she, she should be in her room. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! My enemies have been put to shame. I have a very big hey, who is always by my side. A very big girl. Hey! Chai! Uh, Hello. What is this now? You're not looking happy. Why should I be happy? You think I want this? What have I done to God that that he has decided to make me barren? Mm -hmm. Why has he chosen to make me barren? What is my offense? My love, hey, hey, you're not barren. You're my wife. Okay? You're not just, you're not just my wife, you're my first wife. And nothing is going to change that. Look, this is what we've always been praying for. A child. Right now, my inheritance is secure. Okay, my love. I need you to be happy for us. Hmm? Hey, 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 hey. Look, you're my wife, eh? My first wife. And nothing and nobody's gonna take your place. Hmm? Come. Be happy for me now. Hmm? Oh, God. Let me quickly check on her, okay? My wife, mm? my beautiful wife. <laughs> be very bad. Hey! Oh, don't go. You know, I'm so overjoyed right now. Look, see this pregnancy. <laughs> You don't know what it has done for me. Not only claiming my inheritance, but also making me a father. Look, tell me anything you want, I will do. Anything. My darling husband, I want nothing from you. Other than your love, of course, <laughs> and support. And one more thing. Promise me you would always love my sister, no matter what. Hey, okay. I promise. You have no troubles with that at all. Okay. Okay. I thank you. Well, we thank God, the owner of the universe. Okay. This is what we're going to do. Okay. You're going to get dressed. And 
I'm gonna take you out and do you a little shopping. Okay? Me? Yes, I'll be waiting for you. Okay. Hmm? Okay. Exactly. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. The news reaching my desk is that your brother Fred is expecting a child, your elder brother. What nonsense are you talking about, Barista? What child? Well, he took another wife who is expected to give me a child. So, shit. Hey, you should be happy for your brother, right? Don't you talk to me about happiness. Don't! This has been your plan all this while. Now you've succeeded. What? Yes, you've succeeded. I guess you're happy now. Because I'm not happy. <laughs> you should be happy, brother. Hello. How you doing, baby brother? What did I miss? Um, well, I was just sharing the good news right here with your baby brother. Ah! <laughs> Thank you so much, Barista. Thank you so much. I mean, how, how did you feel? You should be happy for me, brother. Isn't that great? I should be a father very soon. What is wrong with him? <laughs> Come back. Thank you very much, Barista. Sis, you know, I wanted to tell you. How dare you? How dare you call my husband when I sing to you? I'm sorry. Uh, hey, uh, get out! Get out! I said no! Would you, what is wrong with you? No, I mean, what is all this? Listen, you have no right to take her out for anything. Why are you why are you sounding like this? I thought you were cool with me getting married to her in the first place. So why all this? Yes, I was cool with you getting married to her and not for you to and not for her to make unnecessary demands from you. She didn't make any demands. I mean, I was the one that took her out. She didn't even ask me for anything. Where's where's all this coming from? Listen, Fred, that girl came here for a purpose. Okay? Allow her to do her job so she can get out. Alright? You can't be getting her gifts without my permission. Would you? Do you realize you're being unnecessarily really rigid? Really? No, do you realize you're being unnecessarily mean? That girl is carrying my child in her womb. The least I can do is even to show her care and love. You know what? I'm not ready for this. Excuse me. Really? Fred, really? Hey! This demon has taken. This girl wants to take my husband from me. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I've always told you that that girl is up to nothing good. <laughs> she doesn't like you, but she will always pretend to. I, I knew it. I'm a man. I'm a job. That was why I asked you if you were sure she's the one that will give your husband a child. He said, I'm here. I know. It's okay. Now stop crying. Stop crying. Just listen to me. Hmm? I'm just this quiet because she's pregnant though. After delivery. In a tea and one, and kick her out of that house. You're too soft to be okay, Belawa. Let her know you are my daughter. We are not soft people. You heard what I said. Chopia after giving birth. 
Where, where is that idiot now, sir? Okay. After after delivery, kick her out of that house. Move, Okay. Oh, one. Oh. Stop crying. This is not what you can have. Once. Okay. Ngozika. I'm coming. Ha. Oh. One name more. I'm sorry. Ordinary to make oats for me. Eh? It's taking you so long. Why? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The gas what? Listen, if you don't know how to use a gas, you tell me. I can easily get firewood for you to cook outside. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Yeah. I know that what you think you're doing. You want to sit on my expensive chair? Do you know how much is what? And the thing is that. Sin is what? I, I have been having cramps lately. So I get tired easily. You've been having cramps lately. You get... Have you washed the clothes I asked you to wash? That is, that is. I'm going to get to that point. The tiredness is affecting me. Because you've not washed the clothes. Mm -hmm. Are you here to relax? Listen, I do not tolerate any form of laziness. As a matter of fact, I detest lazy people. Okay? So you are not here to relax and eat my food. I can see you're becoming too comfortable in this house. Hmm? Mm, I think I'm beginning to overfeed you. Yes, because why, 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 why all this laziness? Would you please? Don't please me anything. Get to work. You're not here to relax. It's just that you're becoming too harsh on me. Did I do something wrong? I'm sorry. You, you know what? Ngozi, get out. It's the harshness that. Ngozi, get out. Okay. Hey. Sorry. Lazy fool. Can you imagine telling me about cramps, tiredness? Did I bring you here to, to eat my food and sleep? Lazy fool. Just to make oats. Then if I tell you to, 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 to make rice for me, then you, you take three years now. Silly girl. What is this one? What is this one? Eh? Ordinary oats, this girl cannot even do. Cram, sneak, cram, score. This is this one I said. Eh? Simple oats, and the face is looking like this. It's not bad. What? what kind of insult is this one? How will you bring this girl here to eat with me? I don't understand. It's called a meal. A man should have it with his family. Are you out of your mind? Um, please. Are you okay? Please, sir. Uh, let me just leave you before and go. Oh? Okay. Sit down on it. Sit. Yes. Stay here and watch me solve this Sir, please, can I go? Why? I, I can't eat without my sister. She's very angry and I've lost my appetite. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You are grateful. You are worth a ship loading. You are grateful. Doctor, 
I've been having symptoms of malaria for the past two days now. I haven't been able to sleep at night. Well, uh, with the result in my hand here, you are not having malaria. <laughs> Doctor, if I'm not having malaria, what then is the issue? Congratulations, you are pregnant. <laughs> what? You are pregnant. for celebration, you know. Your prayers have been answered. Well, you should know managing two wives is not an easy thing. Put polygamy is a business. It is indeed, my brother. It's, it's more than terrible. Coupled with the fact that the ladies in question are supposed to be sisters. It's more confusing, my friend. So I guess I was thinking it would be easier knowing their sisters. I must say that there is nothing good, there's nothing to write home about, about polygamy. Polygamy is... It's fucked, man. Yeah, but the truth is, you know why I did it. I do, I'm not blaming you, though. I'm not blaming you. You know, I, the thought of my hair science is actually the fountain of solace for me. Hey, why? Because. Yeah, hello? Uh. Um, I don't know. I think I have to leave. I don't know, she just told me to come home. You're pregnant? Mm -hmm. I didn't know what the doctor said. Hey, you're pregnant? Yes, baby. I'm oh my pregnant. god, come here! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how long gone are you? I think about a month or two. I can't remember. Oh, <laughs> look at you! <laughs> <laughs> this is good news, yes, oh, I told you. I'm so happy. Thank God. Have you got a little popcorn? I'm happy for you, I right? thank God. Happy. <laughs> hmm? You know, I am carrying that which you've so desired. I know. I'm going to give you a son, hmm? a male child, mm -mm. to make you the true son of your father. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Baby, I'm so happy finally. Ah. God has decided to. Look out, look out. Hey! What? what are you doing there? Sitting. Who asked you to sit? I... Are you done with what you were doing in the kitchen? No, I just, I'm just happy. Up. Happy what? No, we are celebrating. You want to join us and ask what? Don't worry, don't disturb yourself. Let me just go. Hey, let me go get out. Thank okay. you. <laughs> You mean the two sisters are going to give birth same time? Yeah. You know. You know, I don't even know why God has decided to put me in such condition. I mean, I don't know. You sound worried. Well, you should not worry yourself about anything. Mm -hmm. You got what you wanted. Boy, I'm not ready to father children from different mothers. You should have thought about this before going into it. Yeah, but I never knew my wife was going to give birth early. If not, I would have waited. All the same, you don't need to worry yourself. Okay, you have to calm down. What you need to do is to live with them in peace and harmony. It's most important. Chill. <sighs> After all, you'll be having multiple children from different mothers. <laughs> That's what Abraham. <laughs> Uh, well, children are heritage from God. You know that. Hey, na, tupu bo dogu. Eh? God, I thank you. I thank you. I've always known you will never put me to shame. 
Encore mot. Encore mot. Chef Shutake, vous congrats. Double congratulations. Hi. Maman, there's nothing to congratulate me here for. Nothing at all. Uh, I don't understand. Maman, why don't you understand? Are you not bothered that your daughters are pregnant for the same man? Why would I be bothered? How does this chef shoot a cable? Hey. Eh? I'm not bothered hmm. though. Okay, okay. Ngozika is not my daughter. You know what I go? She's my stepdaughter. So, <laughs> I will still give you the double congratulations. Mama, I'm not having this at all. Mama is not going well with me. I can't have both of them in my house. Somebody has to leave. Eh? One has to go. One has to go. Yes, if possible, leave the child with me and go. Ah, well, if there's anyone to go, it will be Ngozeka. My daughter has come to stay. Yeah. It's okay. Since that is what you want, no problem. One has to go. I was thinking I'll be able to handle it, but no. Sad enough, I can't. Ah, let her go now. But Oga, I was thinking it was going to be a, a double omogo for me. Eh? Yes, now. Mana, since you're not comfortable, hmm. let Ngozeka come back. Let my daughter stay. My husband, mm. thank you for not disappointing me. You've just acted like the true son of your father. <laughs> and I'm proud of you. Thank you, my love. But you'd have to tell her yourself, okay? If not, I will. Baby, that's not a problem, okay? I will tell her that once she delivers, she is leaving this house immediately. She has to leave. Hmm. My enemies wanted to create chaos and unity in my family. Well, shame on them all. Shame on them. They have failed completely. Their plans will never prevail. But I'm worried. Why? What if she refuses to give up the child? Never. Gozika, that I know. <laughs> she dares not. Relax, she's a small fry. I know how to handle. She, ca she can't even dare me. Just relax. Mm. Ha! Why won't she leave? Is she okay? Ha! She knows me. Don't worry, <laughs> baby. Mm. Ah, I'm so proud of you. Thank you, my love. Fine man, mm. handsome man. <laughs> Thank okay. you. Mm? Okay, huh? Obi. Now you go away. Please, I. I have come to apologize for the way I spoke to you the other day. Okay. Secondly, for collecting the bright points of Nkosi in your stead. But I kept it. I said, let me hold it for you. I'll give it to you. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hold your apology to yourself. It holds no water. You should thank your stars that I will allow you to come to my compound and sit on my chair okay so keep your apology for your information my kinsman and i held a meeting and we came to the conclusion that ungozi was never married so whatever arrangement you have there is illegal okay now if you go calm down hmm. calm down we will sort everything out oh uh, 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 Ngozi will come back. In one piece. Uh, yes, so in one piece. Whoever you gave her to must return her to me the way he took her. Is that understood? Come. Okay. So come. Like I told you earlier, she went on a rescue mission. In few months, she will return. This rescue mission you're talking about, what is it? it is, is she John Rambo? I don't understand. To rescue who? And you are talking of few months. Months qua? What is it? You are still counting months? Oh calm down. But you will be She'll come. She'll come. I'll bring her back. Anyway, like I said, she should come back. You pockets. Yes, sir. But leave my house. What if when you help me? Leave my house. Don't thank me. If somebody sees you now, you think that you're a good person.
them now, eh? When they come, you're not even sure. You think the baby is coming? You're not sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure the baby is coming. Eh? Uh -huh. So what do you want me to do? Am I a doctor? Am I a doctor? You need to take me to the hospital. I need to get to the hospital. What? Your driver or what? Because I don't have that strength. Yeah, uh, but I will do you the favor to uh, in booking right for you. Book? Did you say booking? Booking right? Would you take me to the hospital? I said I don't have that strength. Are you dead? Hey. Uh -uh. What's your problem now? You are pregnant, and I am pregnant. Hey. I'm not even. Hey. I'm not even disturbing like you because some shouting before they think I'm killing you here. Guess what now? Oh, I beg, I don't have strength. Hey, Ungo Zika has just given birth to a bouncing baby boy. Hey, hey! Thank you, Jesus. Really? Thank you, God. Yes, both baby and the mother are doing fine. <laughs> hey, hey! God, I thank you. So, Ungo did not only give birth before me. She equally gave you a son. I see she knows that's what I've been planning to give to you. Oh my god, see. Always in a competition with me. Dave, stop all this now. Eh? Stop all this. You should be rejoicing with me. I mean, I have a son. My kid brother and his wife will bear their will their faces in shame. They have daughters. I have a son, Dingpa. Eh? See the way you're happy. Eh? Jumping like a frog. You are happy that another woman gave you a child. Eh? You are happy that another woman gave you a child instead of your beloved wife. Huh? I have always wanted to be the one to make you this happy. But it's unfortunate. My love, you would still give me another you still give me another son. Mm, but hers will be the first son. Forget about all this now. Whoever gives birth first or second or anything. Eh? You still remain my wife. Just with me, eh? I don't know what I'm doing, my son. It's my family now. Congrats. I'm going to see. It's okay. Congratulations. Oh? Mm -hmm. This is pure wickedness. Sister, what is time to gain? I love you as my mother. I care for you as my sister. I support you. Okay. Oh, love you so. Congratulations. Oh. I always die for you, no matter what you do. Oh, what? What nonsense? Who kept this thing here? Who kept this rubbish here in my couch? You're back. What's the meaning of this? Oh, I went to make his food. So if, what if I was coming back with a visitor? I went to make his food. And so what? Is that why you would dump him on my chair? Do you know how expensive this chair is? What if he pees or put on the chair? He's wearing diaper. And so what? Diaper is a fool. I don't like this nonsense. 
You don't know how expensive these things are. I don't like it. You're getting yourself worked up. You can take this rubbish out of here. Stop getting angry now. Is your is your nephew? Nephew, need nephew, yeah. call. Eh? Come and take him out of this place. Stop getting angry now. Eh? Stop getting angry. Hmm? Are you the first woman to have this song? Take it easy. This boy is your nephew. Nephew, need nephew, call. Mm -hmm. And so what? Please take him out. Just imagine where you you, 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 you sprinkled what I don't know on my chair. Because you have a son. Are you the first? Who will not hear what again? Nonsense. Stupid. Who will not hear what again because you, you, you have a son that nobody has, has given birth to before. Big girl, just dressed me now. Used my last strength to talk. Okay, you don't look happy. Yeah, I'm fine, bro. That's it. Hey. Mm. Are you sure? I don't know. The meal won't go cooked. It's as if she didn't prepare it well or he could point. Really? Mm. Ngozika! has gotten to the point where you no longer make decent meals in this house. Hey, I'm sorry, oh. I was attending to my baby and then... Will you shut up? Oh, oh, shut it! Baby, calm down, oh. calm down. I don't know how to explain herself. Because what happened? The baby was crying and had, had the food on fire. Then I quickly went back to change his diaper. Before I came in... Can, can, can you imagine the nonsense? Just can you imagine the nonsense? She's just a baby, baby. Are you the first woman to give birth to a child? Eh? What is wrong with you? You seem to you didn't tell your stupid baby to make excuses. Okay, baby is not stupid. Hey! If you go near. <laughs> Have you seen it? This bastard I brought from the street to come give you a child. She is not talking to me anyhow. She now has the boldness to talk to me anyhow. Oh, honey, um, if you go near. Honey, calm down, at least. Don't tell me to calm down! Listen to her now. Okay, okay, forgive her. Was... Forgive what? See the way she's insulting me after eating my food with this mouth. This same mouth she's using to eat my food. She's using it to not insult me. Talk to me anyhow. Forgive her. Man. Ah, forgive what? Listen, if not for one thing now, eh? I'll go. Ow! Baby, baby, baby. Ow! Oh! Hey, baby, where, the baby coming. Where? Ah! Oh, the baby. Eh? The baby is coming. Oh, the baby is coming. Okay. Um, Just breathe. Straight up, breathe. Open your mouth. Don't breathe. Breathe. She says she'll breathe. She says she'll breathe. Bring it okay. Bring my khaki. Oh, my waist. My such a waist. My such a waist. Bring her. My khaki. My khaki. She says she'll breathe. Breathe.
Oh yeah, baby, you are sorry, sorry. Be sorry. careful. You are going up. No, no, no. Stop crying. What has this witch done to you? What have you done to my son? Nonsense. Sorry. Sorry. Sis, I ask again. You've not said anything. Do you need me to do anything for you? No. Ngozi. You know the circumstances that brought you to my house, right? Yes. How the enemy delayed me in getting pregnant. But um, God came through for me. On the other hand, you also did what you came here for, by giving my husband a child. But you see, I can't continue sharing my home with you. Mm. You have to leave. I, I don't understand. I should go with my child. Oh, no, 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 no. Your child belongs to my husband, so he stays. That is unfair. How can you even ask me to leave my child behind? Look, I understand if you no longer need me here. I respect that. But to ask me to leave my child behind, it's impossible. I can't do that. Wow. Did you just speak to me in that tone? Ngozi, you now talk to me with so much boldness. Huh? You constantly remind me of this one single mistake I made by bringing you to this house. I am surprised, but I'm sorry if what I said upsets you, but I cannot leave my child behind. It's not going to happen. Very well then. When my husband comes back, he will explain further, okay? In case you think that I'm doing this on my own. Until then. Bye. I sacrifice all for you, yet you're not satisfied. You made me do all this, yet you're not satisfied. I showed you through love. So, can my life get any worse than this? Then both women. Give you a son at some time? Yes. You now have two sons. Sure. I mean, I want to be happy. I truly want to be happy, but I can't. One of them has to go. One of them. The kids or your wives? Which of them? My second wife has to leave. But the truth is, I don't know how easy she's going to take it. It's not going to be easy, my friend. It's not going to be easy at all. I would advise you to let it stay. Because she will not want to leave a child. Look, if it's about that, I have a plan for it already. Really? Yeah, I have a plan for it already. I just need one wife and my kids with me. That's my kind of life. If you want to take my advice, I'll tell you to let the both of them stay in the What matter is that they're happy here at all. Right? You just have to take it easy. Allow the both to stay. Do you understand this is not as I heard his both wives gave him a son each. Are you for real? Yes. Hmm. He doesn't know the trouble he has gotten himself into. He will run polygamy and know what it feels like. 
So, are you saying that he might regret his decision? Oh, my love. He may have succeeded in being the CEO of your father's company. But bet me, he will regret it. He wants a polygamous home, right? He will weep. He will grind his teeth. He will suffer. For his decision, he will definitely suffer. <sighs> It's, it's fine, it's fine. It's just that I'm pained that I lost. It's okay. Just relax. God bless you with yours. Amen. Amen. But for now, let him go. But I still have faith. Okay? He will still lose. You still become the CEO. Hmm? Have faith. Um. I'm sure my wife must have told you about my decision. Your decision? Was that really your decision? Well, not really my decision, but our decision. You know, before you came into this house, we already agreed that once you come and give us a child, you'd leave. I wasn't told that. Well, now you know, and um, since the child has come back, uh, I think it's time you would leave. Hmm. See, it's okay. I'll go, but on two conditions only. Two conditions, which are? Fred. When you brought me to this house and married me, you met me a virgin. Mm -hmm. You confessed it with your mouth. Mm -hmm. So I would only leave if you give me back my virginity or I leave with my child. Because uh, um, I, I thought you were an easygoing person. Ngozi, look, try and understand me, okay? Having both sisters in this house is, is not easy for me. It's not my thing. Okay? In the next life to come, I, I know I will choose you. But for now, your sister is my first wife. And I've gotten a child and... You just have to leave. Please, understand me. Well, Fred. I expect you to understand me too. To leave now. No. Okay, tell me, what will it cost you? What, what will I pay? Please, sir, with all due respect, this is not about money. I am not going anywhere. If you want me to go, I have told her what, what needs to be done. You are senseless. You are leaving this house. Honey, Let me see honey, you cross this place honey, right hey, now. Hey, 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 it's fine. You know what? It's fine. You want to stay? You can stay. Baby, mm -hmm. stay where? Just avoid these problems. Just leave her. I, 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 don't, I don't like this thing, no. It's okay. Okwagi, don't worry. Gossi. Gossi, what is it, Kwana? Eh? I, look, I have no problem with you staying in my house, but I can't handle two wives. It, look at it now, it's already driving me crazy. I've told you, just leave. Eh? Now look at it, see, you're having a fight with your sister already. Hmm. 
is ready to eat. My son is ready to eat. Mommy is going to feed you. Yay! Is this what you want to feed this baby with? Eh, Ngozika? Well, this is what I can afford. Since you stopped his father from providing for his upkeep, I can't kill myself. This is what I can give him. Hey! Ngozika! See the way you're suffering this innocent child. Eh? This innocent boy. All because of stubbornness. Give the child for me to take care of. And get out of this house in peace. I said no. What are you even saying? This is my son. He needs me. And I will stand by him. Yes. yes. By giving him the bond beans. Hmm? It's what I can Continue suffering. It's important that I get. Hey! Was it? What a son. It's been no bond. It's not hard. I'm saying it for wrong is my channel. Search! Who will kill your son with bomb beans? Fred, come and see what they are giving to your son. Just open the scale at the same back. Come and look at this. Let me come over and give her all this. Say more that you can handle it. That was why I did not come. Hey, challenging you in your own husband's house. So you call Bobonya la, Amuma. Give that idiot the phone. Let me know the madness that has befallen her. Near phone. Ah, Honoria, cheers, Zonya. See, eh? I am coming to that city by month end. Kamune ana aboli agwon wan. Eh? Let her tell me if it is her husband's house or your husband's house. No, I will come. I will come. Adine ba kwa. Adine ba kwa one we mi we. I will come to the city by month end. Eh? Ngwan. Ngozi, my fine daughter, please, I want you to swear that you will never fight your stepmother and your younger sister. That you will always love them and accept them as your own blood. Papa, yes? I swear and I promise you I will take them as my blood. Oh, lovely. Thank you, my dear daughter. Mm. Truth is that I am getting tired of all this ups and down. But then, I love my son and will always stand by him. I will not abandon him for anything, no matter the pressure. I am hopeful that soon all this will come to pass. God, please, take over the situation and save me and my son. Please. You reward me with wickedness. Every time. You reward me with heaviness. Oh, what is my cry? What did I do wrong? What is my cry? Oh, give me God. What are you doing? Oh, I'm making food for my baby. Oh, okay. Um, take that rubbish away and boil water for me to make pap for my baby. 
Excuse me, I don't understand. I just said I'm making food for... Okay, you know what? I would finish making this, then I would make your baby's food immediately. For what? No, no, ask what? In my own kitchen? In my own house? Are you okay? I don't understand you. Why are you getting angry? Are you mad? I just said, let me finish. I'm already making it. Because I should wait for you in my own house, in my own kitchen, to make food for your baby. My baby has to be fine. Please, don't touch it. Are you mad? Are you dead? It's not are you crazy? See, because I'm keeping you quiet. What is wrong with you? So I'm not I'm just beat you blue 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 black now. Because of what? Look, this is my child we are talking about. I'm making food for him and you're, you're about to throw it away. Don't you try this thing next time. Don't try it. No sense. Because I'm keeping you quiet. No, it's just worry. How dare you? Did you did you lay your hands on your sister, my wife? I... Answer the question. Yes, I did. Why? Why? Eh? Why would you do such a thing? I'm sorry. Look, I don't need this in my house. You told me to love your sister, which is what I am doing, and now you are having a fight with her. You're taking away the peace and tranquility in this house. We don't need it. Both of you alone, it's a lot of trouble for me talking of the fact that you're fighting. I'm sorry. Please. Sorry for yourself. I'm, I'm sorry. I, like mother, like daughter, but nothing right. Manu banu no buru zodi, buzo wa. Be careful. To your steps, don't be hey. faster than hey. your shadow. Sure, okay. Why do you hey. call her? Hey. I mean, why don't you let that girl go? Let her go. I have already given you a son that will succeed you. I've already given you a son to secure your inheritance. Let her go. I, I don't know. I've done everything possible for her to go, but she keeps giving me conditions. Then let her go. Let her go. I already gave you a son, which means your inheritance is secured. Let her go! She can't just live with my child now. I paid her bride price, which automatically means the child is mine to keep. Since she doesn't want you keeping the child, let her go with the child now. Yes, she gave you a son, and I gave you a son too. So what is it? Let her just go and live our lives alone. Please, I need peace in this marriage. Let her leave. It's okay. I think I know what to do. Uncle. I traveled all the way from the village to this city for just one purpose. And that is to take you back to the village. Ah. With me. The village. Uh-huh. Ha. <laughs> husband Kwa. Who are you referring to you to as your husband? Huh? My husband. This one. Huh? Look, he is not your husband. Your wicked, mischievous stepmother here deceived you and married you to this man. Excuse me, I'm here. I know. Why are you interrupting me? She married you to this man without my consent, without the consent of my kinsmen. Uncle, okay, about that. You yeah. know, when my husband people wanted to come pay my bride price, uh -huh. my mother here said you traveled. But she oh. went for that to meet my other kinsmen oh. and she gave them the bride price. Mama, right? Okay. Oh. Is, is it? Huh? You said? Uh, your other kinsmen that I'm not aware of, I don't know them. Blotted lie! This woman did not seek the consent of anybody. I have asked all my kinsmen and they said they are not aware. And as such, your marriage to this man is null and void. Uh, so what is now going to happen to me now? Oh my dear, that is the sad part of the whole story. The fact that you are not married to this man legally means that you are not a wife and your child. 
is not his child. Okay? Now, we are not prepared yet, oh, my kinsmen and I. When we are prepared, this man will understand the gravity of the offense he has committed. Wait, so this whole thing is fake? Yeah, <laughs> scam. Mother, you deceived me. You? What did I ever do to you? Huh? All I have ever done is take you as my own mother. I have loved you, cared for you, tolerated you. I have done everything as a good child, but you do this to me? Why? Huh? And this is how you pay me back with wickedness. Uh, don't insult me, Abalipanam. Do you know what? I have nothing to say to you. But my God will judge you. My God will punish you. Uncle, I will go get my child and live here because I have nothing here anymore. <laughs> Will you keep quiet? Which child are you talking about? Now, if you don't shut that thing, that gutter you call a mouth, eh? I am going to so lo lay a curse on you, eh? It be with Jamne from Yakbamu, right now as we speak. Please, what are you saying? I, I paid a great price. I mean, that child is mine. If you know you paid a bright price, go and meet whoever this wicked woman took you to and collect your money. As for my, my niece and her child, I'm going with them right now, this minute. I'll be right there when I'm prepared for you. Uh, you will see me. Who will you? I'll get it for you. Mama. Who wants to be fast? Mama, what is it? Where go? In fact, my man, you see me as that. Let me wait for outside. I don't want to stay in this kind of room. Sacrifice all for you. Yet you're not satisfied. You made me. Because, because, because hold on now. Please. You can sort this out. Uncle! Because, please. Because you can talk. Yet you're not satisfied. You lured me into this year. Yet you're not satisfied. I cried and waited for you. Yet you're not satisfied. Oh, but please, I'm sorry. Rico, forgive me. Mama. Mama, please, I don't want to hear anything. Anything again that comes out of your mouth, please. Baby, please now, listen to her. Eh? At least we can sort this thing out. Sort what out? No, we can sort what out. That your mother transpired with people. Could not with fake relatives to collect bread price from me. What are, what, are you trying to, what are you trying to say? What do we know? Tell me, what do we want to sort? Mama, please, I beg you. Eh? By the time I'm in and come out, I don't want to see you anywhere around my premises. Hey, baby, no now. Uh -uh. I don't want to repeat myself. It hasn't gotten to that. Eh, eh. Oh God. Honey. Oh God. My love. Baby, wait, wait, wait. Baby. Yeah. Oh God. I sacrifice all oh. for you. Oh God. Oh God. Yes, you're not satisfied. You made me do all this. Oh. Ada. Stop crying now. Eh? Please, stop crying. See, God knows why things are happening. Please. <laughs> Uncle, Uncle, I am so sad. I have suffered so much. <laughs> I feel so sorry for myself. If I had known, I would have listened to you. I would have listened when you came to take me. I would have followed you. Eh? <laughs> Uncle, all I have ever done for that woman is show her love. I have done everything, everything in my capacity to make her happy, but it never pleases her. <laughs> Look at what I am going through. Is it fair? Or then my, my hands is clean now. 
said that it's okay now. You see, I have very soft eyes, oh. As you are crying now, I'm almost crying too, oh. Please, stop crying before I disgrace myself. Please. Eh? See, I can imagine what you went through in the hands of that wicked woman. I told you now, I told you that woman was wicked and mischievous. You didn't believe me. Oh, but it's okay, it's okay. Please. Eh? Oh, God, this suffering was too much. I'm so fat. I'm so fat in the hands of those people. I really so fat, though. And God is just in heaven watching me so far with this child like this. Eh? Oh, it's okay, God. I'll just leave everything to God. Because it's only God that will fight for me. God will fight for me. Listen, my daughter. You see, eh, you don't really know how the law of karma works. Eh? Eh? Sometimes some of these things you are just shedding off karma, shedding off karma. Eh? Don't worry. Just take solace in the fact that I am here to take care of you and our son. Toku. Please. Hoku is just one thing. One thing I promised my father when I was 10, he made me swear and promised him oh. that I would always love my family, no yeah. matter what. Yes. Then I have kept my promise, oh. but they are not making it easy. No, 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 don't worry. I'm your family now. Am I not loving you back? Eh? So, okay, see the beautiful boy that God has given to us. Eh, look at it. It's okay now, nah, it's okay. Stop crying, it's okay, son. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Eh? All right, so. don't worry. Everything will be fine. Eh? Mama Biko, you have to leave. You have to leave now. You see? Oh. Mm. Mama, I have to leave. Yes. <laughs> Wait, though. Instead of defending me, you're asking me out of your house. Ah. Mama, you've seen how angry you've made my husband. Eh? How do I ask you to stay when you've clearly messed things up? How did I mess anything up? No, 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 tell me. How did I mess things up? Is it my fault? Mama, it's your fault. It's your fault. You should have involved uncle. Knowing fully whether this will backfire, why didn't you involve him? How would I have known that your stupid stepsister wouldn't agree to go? Eh? I collected that bride price because I knew the marriage would not last. Did I know that she would even live with the child? Eh? Mama, this one is a medicine after death. Like I said before, you have to leave. You have to leave now and before my husband comes back. Eh? You have already sold your relationship with him. And it will be very difficult for him to forgive you. So people come and start going. I don't want problems. Please. Ha. Hey, hey. Mo, come and start going. Yeah, Biko. Obed, you, I should come and start going. After everything I did for you. Mo, come and start going. Ah, Mama Biko. Mama, please, please. Mama Biko, please start going. Oh, start going, please. Mama, start going. <laughs> mm -hmm. You're balancing. You're... Why will I not balance? Ha. Mommy, I don't want problem. You have to start going. My husband said he shouldn't meet you back when he comes back to this house. So you have to start going, Biko. Mama, stand up. Stand up, stand up, Biko. Oh, baby, baby. you're asking me out of your house. <laughs> it's not my fault, though. It's your fault. It's your fault. You want to spoil my marriage for me? No, you want to destroy this, my marriage for me? Eh? So carry the cross alone and leave, Biko. Save my marriage for me. Wait a minute. You meant to tell me that you paid her bride price to the wrong people? You did. I mean, you were there, you saw them. The uncles, the relatives, all controlled by my mother. Eh? Can you imagine? Such level of evil. Wait, do you know that her, her so-called uncle is not even aware of her uh, wedding? Excuse me. She's not, uh, he's not aware. No, 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 no. That woman is, that, that woman is terrific. The woman is heartless. That woman is devilish. How can she do such a thing? God help her. God help her. Eh? I don't meet her in the house when I get back. I already told her daughter, 
I don't want to see her legs in the house. Because as it stands now, I have lost her sister and my son. You have my support. Whatever you want to do, you need to do that. Look at me. This is terrible. This woman is heartless. I can never, I have told her, I can never have any relationship with her. See, mother and son in law relationship is cancelled. You don't, you don't need to. Hey! Okay, mother, calm down. Calm down, please. Hey! Oh, Ned. I'm so ashamed of myself. A child I gave birth to. A child I raised. I did everything for just for her to be happy. Opened her ungrateful mouth and walked me out of her house. Hey. Hey. Everything. I was even willing to give my life for her. Hey. Just to please her husband. She said I should walk out of her house. Hey. Hello. Who wants to get that? You will be ready to fight for them. Even taking bullets. Ah. Because of them. Only. Only to destroy you with unnecessary blames. Eh? I have learned the hard way. God forbid. My child has taught me a bitter lesson I will not forget in a hurry. Hey. Hey, what are the man? Hey, Ngozi, where is she? Ned, hmm? if I had come back and met Ngozi and that child, I would have adopted two of them, sir. You so, would have done what? Adopted them. Adopted it, both of them? Yes. It is better to take a child who has always wanted you as her mother than the one you are killing yourself to love you. Babu. As well, are you considering taking Ngozi as your daughter? They're going to late now. It has passed. Her uncle came and took her. Oh. Why did go late? Huh? I wish I wish I did the other time. It's late. Adam, okay. now that you are back here with me in the village, so what do you plan to do? Uncle, I have thought of a small business to start, an Akara business actually. It's a profitable business, something I can do very well. Why now? Huh? I told you I'll be able to take care of you and your child. You don't need to suffer yourself now. Go and find Akara for what now? Uncle, I thank you. You have done so much for me, but I can't sit down idle. I need to do something, no matter how small. It makes much more profit here and there. <laughs> ah. Adam. Okay. I'm so proud of you. Thank you, sir. <laughs> you see, what you said now, there's wisdom in it. Huh? Don't worry. I will provide the capital needed for the business. Hey. Huh? Uncle, thank you. Thank is that, you. Sir. Is that right, my daughter? Thank you. Is that right? Hey. Hi. Hey. So, where is my grandson? That one, he has eaten, overfed himself. Now he's sleeping. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, speaking of food, uh. Uncle, I made your specialty. Oh. Let oh. me go and bring it for you. Oh. I'm coming. Adam. <laughs> Uncle. Adam. I'm coming. You will love it. <laughs> hey. I'm waiting. I'm actually hungry. <laughs> Baby. 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 Baby, for how long will you continue to treat me like this? Hmm? Why punish me for the sins of my mother? She made me lose my son. And I would never be happy with her. I know. I scolded her for it. And I still supported you in sending her away. Why are you still punishing me? Why are you still acting cold towards me? Why? 
I'm sorry. I'm not just happy with myself. I'm not. I know. Don't worry, okay? Just look at it this way. Maybe that's how God wants it. Yes, he wants us to have back that our peace. The peace of mind that we've always had. Hmm? I'm very sure everything worked out for good. All right? Don't worry. I will give you more songs. Okay? Let's just concentrate on us so we can have more children. I'll give you more songs, okay? Hmm? Maybe. Yes, Ken, I wasn't expecting you in my office. <laughs> I know. I'm only here to make some clarifications, all right? So having given my brother, Fred, the CEO of my... Point family, of correction, I did not give to him. It was written in your late father's will, which you saw. Okay, whatever. I'm here to inform you about the trouble going on in paradise. So what trouble? Oh, you haven't heard? Fred didn't tell you? Well, if you must know, I was told one of his wives left with his son. So why are you bringing this to my notice? <laughs> Barrister, polygamy was created to fail. And my brother's marriage is not an exception. <laughs> okay. Well, according to the will, to be a CEO, your brother Fred must be a father. And to be a father, he must be legally married. And which I know he's legally married to his first wife. I may not know about his second wife. And again, to further interest you in all of this, you have totally failed. Do you know why? You have lost her because you have always wanted what does not belong to you. Look at you, okay? If you could go this far to wish your brother, Fred, this level of misfortune, it shows how evil and monstrous you can be. I only have a piece of advice for you, Kenneth. Change your ways. Change your ways right now and then every other thing will fall in place for you. You can't go on with this anymore. So this is what you have to say to me after listening to everything I just told you. What exactly do you want me to tell you? said the baby fell from the bed and landed with his skull and there was heavy cut that resulted to heavy bleeding and that caused total brain asphyxiation. Doctor, I don't understand what are you trying to say? Um, sorry. What? Let me see those two left legs of yours in this house. 
mother like daughter, but now she cry. Manu banu no buru zodi, buzo wa. Be careful with your steps. Don't be faster than your shadow. Why do you call her husband snatch, snatch? So this is true. When you told me on the phone, I thought you were playing. No. Your husband threw you out of the house. Why? How? By the way, where is my grandson? It's because of him I'm here. Or it's because of Chimobi. What about him? Something bad happened to him. What? What happened to him? <laughs> Talk now. Talk to me. Agent of suspense. Boom. What happened to him? My children be fell down from the bed when I was watching the no I, I, I was washing clothes. Say that thing again, Biko. Chelo, 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 what? That you were washing clothes. How? You use washing machine. Can one get what? Wait, oh. my grandson fell off the bed when you were watching TV. Hey! <laughs> you a demon. <laughs> you are evil. The only reason people call me grandmother, the only reason you are still married to your husband, is gone. <laughs> and you had the gods to come here. <laughs> Abenuchu, please, I don't want to talk too much. Just carry your luggage and get out of my compound. <laughs> get out. <laughs> I don't want to talk much. Mama, please. I'm sorry, Mama. I'm sorry. Mama, see me. Hey. Hey. They finally got to see me. Oh. Hey. Mama, be cool, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> like mother, like daughter, but now she cry. Manu banu no buru zodi, buzo wa. Be careful. Freddy needs to pull himself together. Just have to take it easy, man. My whole world is crumbling before my eyes. I mean, who did I offend? without putting something to support the child not to fall off the bed. What level of carelessness is that? Some of you are like squeezing life out of her. I mean, what kind of... I, 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 still, I still don't understand. Is that not appalling? I'm sure my brother will get the body here and it's joining for joining. 
because it's going to be getting the title of the CEO. It's over. No, 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 it's not over yet. It's not over yet. You have Uncle's bride. And she's still in your job. So, I'm going to sound as if you don't know what happened. I must have had an unjust baby as well. Listen, listen, man. You need to go back to her first. You never can tell. She could have a forgiven her. Trust me, I don't think she's ever gonna forgive me. I mean, not know after what I did or how I said to her. She won't. Just give her a try first. Give her a try. What has come over you? Let her die now. Eh? Let her die. She's useless to me. Oh no, one more. Banum, banum. These are not done that way. If you stay here, you have yourself to be blamed. Eh? You're going too far now. Ned. Ned, do you know what that idiot did to me? Do you have an idea of what she did to my grandson? My pride. The only reason people call me a grandmother. No matter what she did. It's not enough reason for you to kill her. <sighs> she's still your blood. Eh? Mm. Neddy, it's obvious you don't have any other thing to say. Please just leave. Leave my house. Oh, come on, calm down. I said, calm down. Calm down. Hey, when, calm down. Hey, when, hey, when. If you don't have any other thing to say, you, you, you just get out. After all, you're the cause of all these things. If you did not bring that your stupid um, uh, and ill luck uh, uh, nephew, all this was would it have been happening? Hey, my gonna nephew be well? has turned to bad luck now. Hey, when I brought that young man, did I bring him for you? Is it not your useless daughter that ran into him? She has been a bad luck to this young man, giving him perpetual misery. What is all this? Kuchago. Eh? Kuchago. Ned, you know me. You know me too well. In Manande, we walk. And when I'm angry, I can do anything. Ned, get out of my house. I should leave your house. Leave my house. Make we are easy. Mana, don't nah. worry. Just get out. Don't worry, I will go. Rubbish. Seba, Mana, Noru. Uh -uh. Nonsense. Useless woman. My camera is here. Every day you come here and I show you. Nonsense. Come with a quack a boss. Calm down, calm down. That's the only thing you can say. Bulu bad luck, who put them ever. Come for cooking and one day, who care boss. Nonsense. Ha ha. Get up. Oh. What is this? Like mother, like daughter. But nothing right. What are you doing? Oh, please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, forgive me. You know, if, if I had the opportunity, I would have given my life. Why did you not give your life? Why did you not die in pastors? Eh? If you had died, I would have endured you. Because I'm tired of having a stupid child. Eh? You are just shameless. I regret the day I conceived you. Mama, you are not any better. You are not. Oh, you think I don't remember how you maltreated father when he was alive? Huh? How you plotted his death simply because he caught you cheating on him. Are you talking to me like that? Eh? You act like a saint. You act like you're the holy one. Meanwhile, you are not. You have done more evil than I can ever imagine. All my life you have never corrected me about my wrongdoings. It has always been Ngozika that has been correcting and standing by me, making sure I be of good behavior because she knows that my mother did not do a good job in training me. As useless as Ngozika is, I will choose her a million times over you because you are just stupid. You're shameless! 
Just get out of this house. Get out. I'm not going anywhere. Like mother, like daughter. I'm not going anywhere. You want to go and help me? Mama. Mama. Somebody help me. Mama. Mama, please. Mama, be Mama, don't do Mama, please. Mama. Mama. Somebody help me. Mama, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mama, I'm sorry. People don't know. I'm sorry. Mama, don't worry. I'm useless. Mama, people Be careful. Your steps. Don't be mama, please, Mama, please don't die. I, I, I need you to stay alive for me, Biko. I cannot, I cannot live without you, please. I'm in pain. I don't think I'll survive this. I don't think. So five days. You will survive this in Jesus' name. I will take you to the hospital and you'll be fine. Please. Please. I want you to go and see your sister, Gazika. Tell her that we are sorry. We are sorry for everything we've done to her. No, 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 Mama. Mama, no, it's okay. It's okay, Mama. I will go and see. We'll go and see Ngozika together, okay? First, I will take you to the hospital. You will be strong and we'll go and see her together. Pico. I don't think I'll make it that. Pico. Go and tell her that I'm sorry. Oh, we are sorry. Mama. We will tell her together, you will be strong and we will tell her, we will go and ask for forgiveness and she will forgive us. Yeah. I think so. Mama, why you go? Ah! Sorry, Mama. Mm. Let, me, let me take you to the hospital. Mm. Ah! Mama, do so sorry. Mm. Mm. Mama, do. Mama, is that how you want to stay and sleep? Mama, please! I cannot live without you, Mama, please! Mama! Mama! Mama, please, Mama, wake up! Mama, be cool! Mama, wake up, it's me, would you? Mama, be cool! <laughs> Mama, please! Mama, Mama, please! Mama, 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 please! Mama, I cannot live without you!
Look at this man. Okay. What are you doing in my compound? Sir. Did you bring trouble here? You no, trouble no, the guy. No, no, sir. I, I, I come in peace. Hey, you come in peace. Can you give what you don't have? Just look at yourself. There is no iota of peace in you. You are a troublemaker. Please, can we just sit down and talk? I didn't come here to make trouble. If you like, you can see. If you like, you stand there. Yes, what can I do for you? Um. Uncle, like I said, I come in peace. <sighs> Uncle, um, I should have listened to you from the very start. And I'm sorry about that. I know I did wrong by sending Ngozi away. Um, Uncle, Something bad happened to me. Which is? I lost my son. Which the one Ujuma had for you? Yes, Papa. Ah! Oh God, why that handsome boy? I lost why? my son out of her negligence and carelessness. And I'm on the verge of losing everything. Of course. Hmm. That I know. Okay. Okay, I'm, only, I'm on the verge of losing everything, including the inheritance my late father left for me. Because my kid brother already has children. If I don't have a child, I would lose everything to him. Uncle, I should have just waited for God's time or purpose before pushing myself to um, asking for God's hand in marriage. Okay. Uh -huh. I was just wondering, I said, why did you come here? You just came like a sheep. So not that you really want Ugozi. What you want is just the child so that you can claim your inheritance. No, 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 Papa. Eh? No, sir. So, let me tell you, Ungozi was never your wife, oh. Uncle, I know that. Ah, I know. Uncle, look, I'm just a victim of circumstance. I actually came for Ungozi. But I was told that she had mental illness or something. Yes. Which made me get married to Uju. And it's not like Ngozi is not a good person. Uncle Boa was manipulated. You were manipulated. <laughs> okay, now, ju just look at it. You said you came for Ngozi, right? Yes. And you were deceived to go for Uju. Yes, I understand that woman very well. That wicked wife of my late brother. I know her very well. W very wicked. Yes. You may have been manipulated by her to marry with you. Fine. But now you are coming here now to tell me that you want my grandson and my daughter because of your inheritance. Can't you see that you are being trickish? You are being crafty. Mm -hmm. You should have just told me straight that you are here for them. But now you, you want it to, to get your inheritance. So they are not instruments. Ah, come on. Uncle, no, okay, okay, Uncle, listen to me, please. I came to meet you directly and to apologize and for you to help me beg Ngozi. I am ready to do everything the right way, to pay a bride price, to have to come back home, for me to get my child. I am ready, uncle. Please, put yourself in my shoes. In as much as I will not tell you my decision right now, but I want to get one thing clear. Are you coming to pay her bride price? So that you can get my grandson to claim your inheritance, or you really want to get Ngozi as your wife. I want to hear that answer first before any other thing. Tell me. Look, 
me, please. Just help me talk to her. All I do every day is just to make you happy. All I think every day is about your well-being. My cooperative son ready to eat the sock sock. Zog 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 What is going on here? What is he doing here? Please just calm down, okay? He came to the house pleading that I should bring him to you and I had no option. Um, hello. Wasn't. Freddy, say hello. Mu hello. Freddy, you had the guts to show your shameless face here after all you put me through. You are indeed shameless. I don't blame you. It is my uncle here I blame. Uncle, why would you bring this man to this place? You know this man is the last person I ever want to set my eyes on. Please, I, I had no choice. Eh? I had no choice. Just calm down. Listen to what he has to say. I am not he... interested. I am not interested in anything this man here has to say. Fred, just go, okay? Leave me alone. Because I'm sorry. Eh? I'm sorry. I I did a very, very shameful act by chasing you out of the house. Please, eh? I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Be That's cool, no? it. Fred, this is what you came here to tell me. Look, if you like, lie down on the floor. If you like, fall into the gutter and roll in it. To ask for my forgiveness, I will not forgive you. I will shut. I don't, Papa. I am done. I, I'm going home. I sacrifice all for you. Yet you're not satisfied. You made me do all this. Yet you're not satisfied. I showed you true love. Yet you're not satisfied. You lured me into this world. Yet you're not satisfied. Ah, I should have known. I should have known. You were the one that sent Fred to me. No, 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 no. I, I, I didn't. As a matter of fact, he, he threw me out of the house. He sent me packing. He sent you packing? Yes. I, I was careless with Chimobi. I left him on the bed without supporting him from falling. And then I, I went to the sitting room to watch television. Then Chimobi fell from the bed and smashed his skull no, on the floor. No, no! Ha! Just poor child! Why now? Why now? Ha! What are you doing here, Uchu? I've come to ask you for forgiveness. Please. Sister, please forgive me. I know I don't deserve to be called your sister. All you've ever shown me was through love. Please, please forgive me for all the pains I have caused you. I beg you with everything you hold sacred, please forgive me. Would you please, I am sorry. Mama is dead. She died a very painful death. What? When I got home from the city, she was very angry at me. She wanted to break my head and in the process, she fell down. No! And no! And she died. Ah! No, Mama shouldn't have died. She doesn't deserve to die. Mama seriously wanted your forgiveness. She craves for your forgiveness. She asked me to beg you to please forgive us. I know we treated you badly. 
Please have mercy. Forgive us for everything we have done to you. Yeah. Please. What name is Kobara? Would you? Would you come? You dealt with me. All those times you fought me, you insulted me, you, you, you thought I was weak. You thought I couldn't fight back. No. It was just because of what my father made me promise him. To always love you people no matter what. You people. Ah. Honey, please, I'm it's, sorry. It's, it's okay, please. my daughter. Adam. Please have mercy. You see, I never liked your stepmother. And you know it. Including this one. I never liked them at all. But from the way she's begging and talking, I see somebody who has repented. So I want to also plead on her behalf so that you can forgive her, please. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Forgive you. Forgive you for all you and Mama put me through. Well, my mama should not have died. You saw me. Mama should not have died like this. No. It's okay. It's okay. Stop crying. It's okay. Ngozi, please, I, I feel very ashamed and I'm sorry for what I put you through. Please, find it in your heart to forgive me, please. Go one name. Now that you have forgiven me, I want to ask you for a favor. Please forgive Fred. He's a good man. I know he he's treated you badly, but it was all my fault. It was all me. Please forgive him. Accept him back. Be go. Accept him back. After all, he, he, he came for you first. Yes, he came for you first before Mama and I connived and, and took him away from you. Yes, Biko. um. Unga. Unga, unga, unga. <laughs> My daughter, you know, in our family, love runs in our blood. And that is why we leave the law of karma to take care of things. Hmm? You see what she just said? That is the truth. I never liked this man either. But he explained to me and he told her that your wicked stepmother manipulated them. Okay? So he has um, begged and I want to plead also that you forgive him. You know, see, let me tell you. He has told me that he's coming to pay your bride price. Mm -hmm. Uncle Biko, Fred, I have forgiven you. But both of you should continue. I don't want trouble. Sister Biko, no, there will be Biko, no Sister, no, there will be no trouble. Okay? Matter of fact, this, this, this marriage wasn't meant to be. He didn't come for me. He came for you. You both were meant to be, please. It was Mama that connived. I am Mama, we could not even took him away from you, please. As it stands now, I, I'm, I'm leaving this village. Okay, I'm just going to find my way. I'll just go and put myself together. I'm not interested in marriage for now, please. Remember he came for you first, like I said earlier. Pico. That, that was what they used to convince me. He actually came for you first. Just that. You know your wicked stepmom now. She just manipulated all of them. Your star is there. I told you now. Hmm? God will bring somebody that will wipe your tears. And it's bringing back Fred to come and wipe your tears. Okay? All I do every day Is just to make you happy All I think every day it's about your well-being My 
Hey Fred, I was just about to reach you on the phone. Uh, Please have a seat. Good day, Barrister. Good day, how are you? Mm, I'm fine. Your younger brother just left my office and he has threatened to sue you for breaching what was stated in your father's will. I don't know how he got to know that you lost your son. Uh, that was given to you by your first wife whom you legally married to. And then he again, after the news of your son's death, he came here to gloat and return with an information of the authenticity of your second wife, whom you legally also got married to. But then there is another version to this whole story. That you mispaid her bright price to a drunk person entirely. Listen to me, Fred. He has a point here to prove when we get caught. But I can assure you that I'm ready for him. Barista. Barista, get the company to him. What? I can do this. You... Barista, did you hear what I said? Fred, what has come over you? He's right. Yes, I gave the wrong person my wife's bright price. But even at that, you can still correct this by giving the right, right price to the owner. First, I don't cost of me losing my child and to my wife. My first wife. I had everything. Yes. And I was almost ruining the chances of a young lady getting married all in the chase of having a child. Even after giving me the child. I still sent her away, still trying to take the child from her. Isn't that an evil act? Which is not me, all on the quest of wanting to get the title of a CEO. Huh. I used to know. I'm sure that was the reason that God had to take away my first child. Oh, well, it is what it is. So at this juncture, I've decided to relinquish the position of the CEO to my younger brother. Are you very sure about this? First, I am very sure. You know, family is everything to me. In this whole quest for CEO ship and all, a whole lot of things has gone down. And truthfully, each time I get to think about it, I remember the terrible things that has come down and doesn't go well with me. So I would come back to sign every necessary document and paper to discuss. I, I hope you understand. Yes, I do. It's okay. It's okay. Um, I will have to do the need for them. Thank you, Marissa. I sure would uh, take my leave right now. Right. That cause get to luck. I sacrifice all for you, yet you're not satisfied. You made me do all this, yet you're not satisfied. I showed you through love, yet you're not satisfied. 